piss your big round. <laughs> <laughs> you cheeky bass. I only can't put yourself there, you bass, would you? <laughs> you dirty pucks. <laughs> um, yeah, no, anyway, we are live. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to your regularly scheduled Tuesday evening. Well, not regularly scheduled, we had a break week last week, but we're back. Tuesday evening, tier one action. We are here for round five of season 14, and we are going around the track we... Normal, the real life F1 going around a couple of weeks. We're going around the Shanghai International Circuit, I think that's what they call it nowadays. And again, this promises to be a very interesting evening. Uh, and of course, I am Kelsey 98 and I am Giant. Obviously, now he's, he's come to an older man. Falls of Brendan. Brendan, how are things? Not too bad. Uh, looking forward to this one. Um, it's definitely going to be a very, very hard track for a lot of the drivers. Mm. One of the worst in the calendar, in my opinion. But, I agree. Um, I agree. Don't should, watch my performance yeah. last night. <laughs> don't worry. I uh, like. I saw it. <laughs> ah um, no! I don't want that. That's what I don't want. I don't want people seeing that. But, uh, yeah, it should be a good one, nonetheless. It's just a very tricky. It's a very uh, technical circuit, and you've got a lethal mixture of those really hard corners, and you have got this long uh, straight then where you can slipstream DRS, and so oh, it's a it's lethal mixture crazy. of everything. Crazy. The slippery yeah. effect around here is nuts. I, like, I, I was doing it short qualities and the tow I was getting was bonkers. I was like, and That's I think Lucky Nutshaw said it as well. I think he started the, he was ahead of, I think it was maybe my teammate, Kay Flemmer last night. Kay Flemmer started the, the, the bottom of the straight nine tenths back. By the time we got to the mm. top of the straight, he was ahead of him. Yeah. And that's, well, there's no other track in this game, I think. Maybe back you, but like, realistically, there's no other like natural track in this game where you can do that. Like be that yeah. far back at the start to a straight and still make the overtake as I see who's the Alpha Tori, it's one of the two boys. Uh, My God, it's it's the, it's the end of championship at the moment anyway, so mm. nothing going but on it's... specifically good. Yeah, but I was actually looking at the standings as well recently and uh the standing that uh, just went up there and uh yeah. I was actually shocked actually at how how they looked because I actually didn't realise the points gap between You've obviously got P1 and P2, but then yeah. you're looking at the likes of Rian and Section. Rian is 50 points off the lead. Yeah, and we're at the halfway point of the season. Yeah. Uh, isn't it? Yeah, so this is it. Like, really and truly, this is a massive race. This is uh, Rian's last chance, in my opinion. To really and make, like, keep, keep an hours in there and... To keep it in, yeah, essentially, to keep himself within a shot. And for Section, I think, you know, not that it's his last chance, but... I think if he's serious about the championship, he's really got to get the hammer down this one and, and absolutely. really just take absolutely no no uh, prisoners. And um, but he's going to have Saucy right there as well, who who I would expect has sweated his bollocks off for this one. <laughs> I haven't seen as, the time trial, but I would presume that's that's what he's done. As I think Josh <laughs> may be screwing himself here because he's coming up behind the load, but he's yet he's, he's letting him go. Good oh, man. Right, Brendan, you are going to take us away. Josh is the first dry lap of the evening. Away you go, he bottoms out on the curb actually. <laughs> <laughs> but Great off start. you go. Okay. Well, here we go. I'm in the Red Bulls. So um, this uh, this corner is always a really, really tricky one to get. You just need to make sure that um, uh, you try not to uh, lose the rear. And then you've got this, this, uh, this traction zone. I absolutely suck at this traction zone. I could never get it right. <laughs> uh, uh, but then you're going into this like hard braking zone. The worst corner in the just, game. Just yeah, to you put just that want to hug there. that curb. You want just want to use as much track as you can. Get on the power, and this is like this is another worst part. Basically, all the corners around here are terrible. That is just <laughs> uh, that is just the way of it. But you've just really got to slingshot the car in through here. Another like heavy braking zone, and you've just got to glide the car through this corner as best you can. Don't hit that curb on the right. Watch up to this car ahead, by the way. Yeah, he should get a toe off him if he's... Oh, he's oh no, away. he won't go. Oh, yeah, it's all right. It's a bit of a distraction, but... He was um, on Inter, so best, best, I think, getting out of it. Yeah, yeah. But this part as well... Yeah, he's oh, he's got... Rear. I was just going to say <sighs> that. <laughs> you can... It's so easy to lose the rear around that. Around that part of the track. Um, he's going to get beached. He needs can... to go forward. He's going to get disqualified if he doesn't move. Yeah, he, he needs to go forward and go back. Yeah, there you go, Josh. Yeah, he's all right. That's all right. 
I thought oh, like, a tidy enough lap actually I, bar that. So it did. It was. It looked all right. I tell you what, he's a man who does like to get. He loves to burn through his tires and qualifying. The amount of times he spins is gas, honestly. And that's not. That's yeah. not a shot. Like, and by the way, there's a dirty, dirty out towel going on here. But it's, it's 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 an in that towel, so it doesn't really mean nothing. But now, nah, like, yeah. and that's not a shot to Joshua. Like, it's genuinely that's one of them where he gets so unlucky, but he ju- he just catches the the worst spots on the track to do. You know, it's just you yeah. don't want to be the first one to spin either, because uh, I've been there many a times. He's going. Is he going again? I wonder. He's not going to have enough battery say, to do. It. Oh, hang on. Well, no, he's, t- he's given a. I towel, would say you you're know? better to go off into the pits and just get one banker and. He has uh, shield maybe. on board, so has he? One point something. He's got. Hey, yeah, I say you go again because look again. It's a short session here. We, we're, we're losing two in this first qualifying session. You might go. I think he's going to go again. Yeah, he's going again. Josh is going again. It is Dan the Danaway. We go about it, Dan Yeah, in the A man who has found yeah. some of what you would say is old pace. This I'm talking not old pace. I'm talking season six pace from Dan <laughs> when he last won the championship. He's looked mighty, and nobody can take it. Like we're seeing some shades of the man who dominated a few seasons back, and mm. it's good to see. It's good to see someone like that who again he's had he's had a few tough seasons as Dan, and we'll see what There's he can do to, tonight. There's a lot of experience in this tier from one oh, way or another from yeah, past yeah. games. Like, so. It's actually quite unique in that way. Like The, it, the uh, fact that we have so many like long standards in the league all racing together. Like, typically, you see lads moving on and, you know, yourself, like, moving on to different leagues, different challenges. Mm, but mm. the crop we have here, like, I can tell you now, Saucy, Dan, Farrell, Rian, Maglox, Fanjo, Colin B, Section, Seabooks, Dylan, Josh, um, Dilza. And Khan, they've they've been they they've raced with each other for seasons upon seasons. There, like, they all know each other so well. And you obviously you throw in the odd newcomer every now and again, Raven, Moz, Megan, uh, who else is there? Like, Sank goes in tier one for the first time full time this season. Mm-hmm. And we have a couple of newcomers like Lucky Nushot is making his impact now. And obviously, he's he hasn't had the best run in tier one this season. Is that Josh around again? Josh is off again. I just went on board. Disaster. He's I think he's having out a great time actually. in the grass in there. I'm on he? board he's with. Literally, he's literally touching grass. I'm on board at the reserve driver here. A man making his long awaited return to league. Well, you might not know it. Dad's F16. He's a long time man back in back in the I say all days two three seasons ago. He's been he's been away for a little while, but good to well, see him back. He wants to get back in and around the action. Tier two, tier probably, three type of man. Very good. He's put in a lot of effort into his helmet, which I really like. He's definitely <laughs> given that a good bit of thought. So I you like, know what? Fair play, that's, though, uh... yeah, that's it. <laughs> Anyone? I don't know that. Poor Josh. I tell you what, he has. A, he just doesn't like qualifying. <laughs> I'm going to have to say, I put him into a different, a different card on the Red Bull. Yeah, uh, Josh. <laughs> yeah, Josh is someone I think I'd like to see a bit more from in terms of like just in terms of. What he can do with he's a very uh, quick driver. He just this yeah, game this is it. Has, like, has yeah. uh, this game has disguised how quick of a driver he really is. And yeah, I, I obviously just the, the longer this game is drawn out, the less people I, I've I've personally this season have gone backwards. I'm like in my opinion, like mm-hmm. I have pace. I just can't unlock it. It's, that's it. I'm, it doesn't like does it bother me? Yeah, massively. But it is what it is. You make deal with what you have. Josh, I feel is someone like similar to me in that sense. Mm. I think. He's been not exposed. Exposed wouldn't be the right word to use, but cut out maybe slightly to, to, with the mechanics of the game, and it's affected his style a lot. I think and the way he, as Josh, he's a mighty driver. He's been around for a long time, competing for two two championships, mm. and again, he's just it's one of them games. It's you're either really good or you're really not, and I think he's caught the, the bad end of it for the most part, but. Mm. It's good if he can give a bit more time. I think the pace is there. Just again, it's one of them games where you need the confidence, and if you haven't got the Absolutely. confidence, you're not really gonna make the the strides you need to make. I it's actually uh, re-downloaded uh, like F1 2021 uh, yesterday <laughs> for the pure because on the uh, podcast with uh, Dylan, mm. I actually was kind of going, oh, you know what, I might re-download F1 2021 again and just see, <laughs> and like. Oh yeah, granted, I tried it on the pads and I, I uh, did race on the wheel on it back then. But like, yeah. oh my god, if you ever want to have an example of how of actually how good the handling is on F123, is then it's been the only bright spot in this game. Like, as in how mm. how accessible the cars are to drive. Yeah, F1 2021 is without a doubt 
one of the craziest, most awful, most putrid experiences I've ever had. <laughs> Actually, just jumping straight back on it. Game and, and it's funny seeing a lot of the times from a lot of the guys actually, uh, Dilzer and uh, like and Colin B and everything. Those were some sweaty times that they that they put in back then. <laughs> so like you know, uh, <laughs> dare I say they were absolutely uh, like yeah, like on alien pace back then. But uh, yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah, it's interesting. As we had we have a, a man on a lap, a, a certain sandbags. Again, a man who's out, another man who's looking. Kind of first time advice, you'd almost say, would you, Brendan? Uh, he's also well, he's in that be- little mix with Rain and Sexy, who need to make the move. Obviously, he's up there. I think he's second in championship at the moment, did he? He is P2, yeah. And I think that's been for Las Vegas. Uh, was it Las Vegas was the race that we just done? Uh, or, or Last week? Was it? Yeah. Or the, uh, yeah. Um, that's a good question, Brendan. Or was it? Or was it Singapore? I can't even remember. Oh, it was at night anyway. What happened there? No, sorry, it was Saudi Arabia. That's where we were. Sorry. Get it, get it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, I went down. Um, I went off there and there, mistake. <laughs> that was a great example of uh, Dylan not being on the pace in qualifying, but mm. he just kept it clean and kept it smart. And that's, and that's he, again, that's so key. Yeah, yeah. And I think like this season, like I, I think Dylan has improved so, so much ever since. Really, I think the start of season thirteen, he was a little bit. Oh, that's a good lap time. Like, at the start of season 13, he was a little bit, like, you know, he wasn't really there, but then as the season picked up, and he has carried that form absolutely into mm. the season. I think out of yeah. him and Rian, I didn't. I Speaking thought Rian would carry that form. Oh, oh. 30 on 4 from Colin B. Look at this fella. <laughs> That's a very good kill one time, I have to say. I say it comes Rian, the man who I know for a fact is looking for drifts to carry on the second last corner, but he is... Again, he's a man who needs a good race. It, he needs a race in his favour, and this is a race that mm. he seems to be confident. So you'll see what type of banker he's setting. Twenty-one three and Q one is outrageous, if you ask me. <laughs> Outra- well, genuinely, that's... that's a crazy Q one time, if you ask me. That's already quick in a pole last night, as far as I remember. Yeah, like but that's psycho times. Let's come back after. Looks like he, it looked like he came off the throttle halfway down the street. I wonder was he, was he afraid of catching this rebel? I was maybe he's just like I don't know. He's probably just afraid to show everyone his true pace. He wants to wrap the wraps. Magdox went P two there by the way and all of that. I was trying. Mm. I was just looking to get a time to get him through to the next session, which is all you need. He's just up to P six. Not a bad time. I don't think that. I don't think that's enough. Mm, I I, mean, I, yeah, I, I gonna... think you'd want to be in the thirty one here to be safe, wouldn't you? Oh, absolutely, yeah, yeah. You really don't want to, like, you just want to get uh, Josh's off again. Um, oh, poor fella. I think he's on an outlap, didn't he? Oh, no, he's not. He is, yeah. Oh, no, he's set a lap, he's set a lap. Oh, he's has not, he? not the oh, most okay, competitive, not enough. the most competitive. Sorry, he must have just been letting people through. <laughs> um, who is on a lap there in the last, is that, who's that Haas on a lap in the last sector? No, it's Colin B coming in. Aston Martin, that's Rain coming in also. Who's yeah. that, that Williams? Alpine? Sanko? Where's Sanko? Sanko's on yeah. lap. I'm a border fan, Joe. We'll say about a fan, Joe. He's on a pulp in middle sector, according to the game, but I don't believe that. Nothing mm-hmm. against Fanjo, I just don't know what to believe with this game. <laughs> oh, look at right this. this season. Cheeky little toe. Fanjo's a man, he just kind of knows... Uh, he knows his style and like how to, how to use it to his man. That may sound very simple, but he just knows how to use his own style, which a lot of lads don't actually understand their own style. Fanjo understands his own style. 2AT mm. and he uses it when it to an advantage or not he uses his own style so well as coming to the line is is Franjo look at this fella we have a little section as well I'm looking on board him right here can he go last corner oh a little bit of over so you would say That's maybe probably. I think yeah. that should be just about enough which is all he wants there's, he wanna... there's a lot of time in that uh, I agree just That's as fair. I, I so I just as I went on board with him, I think he did have a massive tank slapper. Mm, yeah. Um, uh, coming out of that uh, spoon section, so yeah, I would say there's a lot more time in that from. On board here with Sanko coming through the end of sector one, Pope of sector one apparently, but again, take that with a pinch of salt. This is the type of track I think that Fangio was really going to relish. I think because I think it was the same in Portimao for for whatever reason he seems to really 
do well at tracks that are just that uh, bit more difficult. He just Brandon, doesn't... Forward. He just doesn't... <laughs> oh, Connor B is retired in the pits. Forwards. Low wings, long straight. Mm. That's Fanjo. This is Fanjo's medicine. This is... he's He'd be liking a track like this. Now he's, he has... I know he's putting in the old grind. But um, mm. forwards, low wings, long straight. I think that's where he's going to excel tonight. He's going to... Oh, Dilza has left the session. Oh, oh, he's in the drop zone as well. Can you drop him an invoice? Or have you got him? Uh, I'll drop I'll do it. As well. Dylan's in yeah, the pitch. Yeah, I retired. actually have zero of these people added as friends, so I am the worst person to ask. Yeah, yeah I'll, to, get, I'll get him now. I'm on board of Sanko there. If you can go on board of Sanko for me and see what time he sets. Yes. Uh, oh, he's on pole, 31-3. Nice. Wow. What was the track that Sanko... Get back? What was the track? Was, uh, was Sanko doing really well at one of the tracks? Australia, I think, well. was it? I think it was, yeah. He just was... Like, he just came out of nowhere. Fanjo! What? Disqualified! <laughs> I don't believe it. Why is he? I don't believe it. Was he blocking section? Yeah, I think he was. I, no that's way. unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> he is going to be snapping. Well, we know who's joining us in the commentary box after this session. I'll tell you oh, that. Oh, I don't believe what I've just, ha what I've just seen. I think Dills have got in just in time, by the way. That oh my mental. god, that's criminal. That is criminal. <laughs> but if anyone, likes a for, if anyone likes a for, uh, an event from Last of Force, it certainly finds up. <laughs> oh, I don't Man, believe what I've just seen. That's cruel as well, isn't it? That's so cruel. I, I think I cursed him by uh, saying that he's going to do really well <laughs> right here. So that's the game going. No, Brendan, you're you're so wrong. It's not going to happen. Well, now we only do is war. We are only losing one. I find you were sitting pretty. You were sitting top of the pile. Well, he was P2 uh, yeah. before Sanko. Yeah. So, but... like, it's, like, why was he, like, as in, like, either the game has really done him in there. Or is, like, or the more likely is that. Slow? more likely the game screwed him. But then but, why uh, would you go slow in the pit lane? Other than uh, to, like, I don't get that. That's, oh, the... that's bonkers. Dan has taken a different line than what I've seen all week so far. Two to one and two and three and whatever so complex corners that he's going to so throw section tight. thinks he's safe as well so he's I, well, I think so he's like... safe I think section's safe I think the one Dan O'M is it, it, the trouble one here in my opinion Sashi and yeah. Connors at the same time I think Dan O'M is the one in trouble I, I say trouble I, I do think he probably will be safe when it's all said and done but he's gone out to give himself a bit of security and I think he's the first one on a lap is he or Dills are out there is that Dills on an out lap I was at Con the Force Carry. Yeah, the, both McCann's on an outlap. As Dan O'Reilly is four and a half tenths up on his own time. So 31 7 territory. Looking around uh, Dylan at the moment. Dylan's are finished. Dylan's not made the line. Dylan's out. Dilsa's That's right, qualifying. Yeah. That's qualifying. Q1, so really I should it's, say. It's just up now. It's, uh, there's only one more driver that can How be is he not made the line? It, yeah. Oh, it's cruel for Dylan. He gets another. Because he's had such bad luck where. The timeouts. Oh, his car is gonna cause mayhem. Dilza's car is gonna cause mayhem. I'm gonna go on board back on board with Dan. Very tidy. Ooh. Very tidy. I'd say he just probably lost a tenth in the spoon section. He, he his left tire just clipped the curb on the outside a little bit, yeah. and that just would have maybe just you know made him kind of slow down. Otherwise, he he would have really unsettled the car. So there's time in that definitely. So. That's a that's a tight qualifying. Like those times are very very close. Uh, Raven as well. Like if, if bother, he is on yeah. if he is on new gear, like in terms of a new setup um, with a wheel and everything. I think it's been since the start of the season, so he's still kind of adjusted. I think to his preferences. Yeah. I wonder. Psycho is very upset. By the way. Very upset. What's he upset about? He said he didn't block anyone. The game screwed him. Ah. Which makes sense for this game. So anyone, I, I do, do think we've a few watching us here so far. It's not not a whole lot this evening. I know football's on, so we have a lot of competition this evening. But you know what? 
It is what it is. Yeah. Might do. Interesting Q1. As Dilza got had disconnect issues and Franjo had a major game issue. So two very common issues with this game. Um, although they are two lads who maybe won't mind too much being at the back in a sense. They have the pace. We know that. We know that. Fine, will be upset because I think he had a chance of a very good start in that position. Yeah. As what are we waiting on? Oh, there we go. Interesting Q1. Unlucky Q1 that you would say is a, a, a phrase you could, a word you could use to yeah. describe it. As we'll go through who we had. Sanko takes us through a P1 that session. Green P2, Maglox P3, Colin B P4. C books P5, Dano M P6, Idolano P7, Farrell 8th, Section 9th, Saucy 10th, Khan, Daz, Josh, Raven, and Sanity Israel, who was Mos Megan. Ah, uh, see us through the Q2. He got through on the enters too, which is uh, interesting. <laughs> ah, he was true. He was on the mediums when he finished the session, so he just he was on a slow lap. Fair enough. Um, Dilza had connection issues, and Fanjo had a game error. Which is unlucky. The game called them that he blocked someone and he didn't apparently. So again, mm -hmm. unlucky for Fanjo. Couple of weeks now in qualifying, I think he's been a bit hard done by, but he won't be too fond yeah. of that. I tell you that for a fact. Won't be too fond think, at all. I think this is a Dilzer's first race back as well in a while, isn't it? He's missed. He a missed last races. week. No, he just missed last week. I think. Ah, okay, okay. Well, if anything, he probably won't mind, uh, you know, maybe just kind of getting through the field. It's it's always a nice kind of challenge. I would say Dilzer is easy enough going in terms of he is his results chill. this season. He's so, chill. yeah, I think he'll probably enjoy maybe just the opportunity to get through the field. Cause he Again, has in pace, saying so. that, he, he's won a race. So he's up there. That is true. He's yeah. won a race. And again, I say it every season, Dilzer is just someone you can never count out. As yeah, well. that's what, the thing, like... He's he's got the pace, and then there, like there's other races that just doesn't go his way for him. But it's it's mm. kind of that thing of like you know, he has the ability. I think he's got his he's got every chance, like as much as Section or Saucy, mm. uh, to actually make a run at the championship. Absolutely. But maybe just the results don't go his way. But and speaking of stuff that doesn't go your way, we have a very disgruntled Alpha Tari in the box. Find out. <laughs> Uh, your agreements is because I know you, you feel screwed right now, and we feel unlucky. You like the game screwed over? How? What? What happened? Oh man, like it was just stupid. Like I go out in the softs, and 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 I kind of get out of Josh's way as he's finishing his lap. I start my lap, and he's parked in the fucking race line, turn one. So I'm fuming, and then I end up setting a good lap, and for some reason he does another lap. And uh, or I think he does. So when I'm going into the pits, I have a look behind me because I think I see a red ball. I'm like, just see if it's him. Mm. And I stop for one second, and then I keep going, seeing a section, and it it won't let me accelerate and tells me it, I'm disqualified from session. Oh. Like it's actually a joke. Mm. Oh, it's, it's just it, it's just the way it's coded. Like I say, the way it's coded is if the game sees someone this close for a, 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 a length of time, it's gonna say, oh no, see you later, I'll get out of the game. And it's it's one, crazy. I'm saying to lad, there's one track where I like might be able to yeah, have a chance of That's what I was just said at the Brendan and there's like it was one of those tracks where you you'd expect maybe a good qualifying and result in the good like, stand position. This uh, this is a Portimao. Yeah. Uh, this is a Portimao uh, track yeah. for you essentially. Exactly. Like this is. <laughs> we're we're doing short quality myself, Brian, Dylan, and Mags or whatever, and like Brian was doing thirty point fives and fours or whatever, <laughs> and I was doing the same. Crazy. And, like, I think uh, the only one, the only one I heard of doing that low was like Sanko or something. Yeah. Uh, it's just, just fuming, man. But there you go. Like, I just have to fucking try and pull one out of the bag again, like, in the race. <laughs> uh, it's worked for you so far, hasn't it? Yeah, but, like, unfortunately, I think it, it ruins my chances of winning the oh. race. But let's we'll see. Yeah, mm, uh, yeah, I think so. Do you know what I mean? Like, when you've got these good drivers around in the league, it's very hard to. Oh, yeah, 100%. Now you have to try some different strategies, some different like you have to try something yeah. completely what what you weren't expected to have to try. Yeah, my only my only hope is there's forecast for rain after sixty minutes. Oh, 60. You need, 60 a, you need a safety car maybe to get you that oh, one. I need, I need safety car. I need a rain to come earlier, like. Mm. Oh, 
posture. Well, well is, it, uh, is it a high chance of rain after 60? It goes 30 something percent after 45 and then 81 percent after oh, 60. Oh, yeah. So, so, so we end, could yeah. see we'll towards the end, we should, could see a few drops, but maybe not heavy enough to go to Inters or something like that. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Interesting. So, we shall so, see. How is, you're obviously in the party today with your teammate. Eh? How is, how is my guy feeling? He looks relatively quick. He actually wasn't as quick as us in the short quality. Like, we were doing, as I said, whatever, and he was kind of doing more eights, really, and maybe a yeah. seven. But didn't, he just couldn't find a proper setup, so listen, he might surprise or whatever, but um, I'd say it'd be someone more like Colin B or Sassy even. Or, or my best Sanko. girl board, Sassy, is right what, the finish lap. Sanko's probably the favourite, but there you go. Interesting. Well, we won't hold you for a whole lot longer this evening, if I don't know. That game has just completely probably ruined your evening up to now, up to now but <laughs> we'll, um, we'll leave you go back to your team, mate. Eh? We won't hold you too long this evening. We'll hopefully Cheers, have you back in the end of the race, we'll see. Is uh, Rain in your party as well, Fanjo? He is, yeah, he is, yeah. Go and tell him, like, not to, like, come back into the commentary this race, because it would be <laughs> nice to see him in Q3, so you can tell him I said that, so. He's expecting to see you after Q2, but there you go. Oh, sandbags, sandbags. <laughs> uh, speaking of Alpha Tori, here comes Maglox to the line. What type of time is he going to set? P5 for Maglox. And Sections actually just done a really good lap, a 31-4, yeah. so that's that's more like it, like, that's that's what you need. Well, it was, I think Sanko done a 31-3. Is that Rian on a I lap there behind? I think it was out lap. Rian, let's see. No, he's on a, yeah, on the out lap. Um, Josh, can Rian? Josh finish the lap? He can. What type and of Josh can got he through as well, after he all did, that spinning yeah. and, and everything. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he, and, he, and he sets a decent time there as well. Very good. Yeah, the 31s are looking, it's... Very, very tight, like at the top. So, uh, Paul will be um, in the 30s quite easily. Yeah. Quite easily. Oh, uh, Josh like, Gosher's been. It, it sounds like the uh, the sweat is on, uh, like Gallic, according to Fangio. Seems very legs. close. Yeah, seems very close, I have to say, at the moment. It, Rain is, really, I believe, going to be the next man on a lap. No, Seabooks is on a lap. He's in really Valadet. Where's he in Valadet? Oh, you know what he's doing? He's got the decent next lap in validation. Oh, no way. Oh, I don't know. I hope he hasn't gone out on a new set. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that sucks, man. Farrell um, is on a new lap. I'm really hoping Rian has a good one. Like, I, I just think the... it It's the kind of track where I think he, he can really... You know, if, if that's the times that he's setting, like, according to Fanjo, like, that's, <coughs> that's going to be... Uh, that's going to be interesting. Yeah. As he is coming into the last couple of corners now, so you will stay on board on here for the for this tap. Give him the screen time, hopefully it's some motivation. We will do. Brendan, if you wanna crack us away here, I'm gonna rest my voice. No <laughs> I'm actually yawning at the moment. <laughs> but uh Alright, let's see how he does in the uh in the first couple of corners. You've just got you just gotta launch it in here and just try and and I uh, trail break the car in towards this corner, so he hooks that up pretty nicely. Okay, George can't do that. He stays in third, going through here. So, oh, a bit of wheel spin. Well, Jesus. Not too bad. I've seen worse. Um, in fact, I did do worse uh, last season around here. So, um, just don't think the that's the strongest four sector. That's not the strongest four sector. No, I wouldn't say so. Uh, it, it's so. It's. It's those kind of uh, moments, like, which can really lose you, like, a tenth yeah, or two as well. Exactly. Like, you wouldn't think it, but... It's the confidence as um, well. Like, you mess one bit up, it's going to be on your mind. Oh, shit, I'm at, now I'm making up time, and now I'm chasing the time, and... That's yeah, what you don't want. You it. don't want to be chasing the time here. That's this a good middle it. sector, like, It's a good middle sector. But I think this lap looks pretty tight. This is really where it's all going to be won or lost, I think. He doesn't clip that Again, curve, which is He doesn't good. need he just... to do as fast as lap right now. He needs to do it after yeah. getting through to the last session. Then he can do as fast as lap. This is it. So that's all. He doesn't need to do a barn burner right here now. Like it just needs a it's solid lap. That's all he needs right now. Solid, solid lap. Um, Why did coming. Moss Megan change his name? I haven't got a bruise. I'm gonna have got a bruise. <laughs> it's like, I don't know just... what's what's a better name. Moss Megan or Sanity's fool? I wouldn't like to be calling myself a fool now. Oh, oh mean validate. Is... No. <laughs> gonna have to back out. Oh, he still ke oh, he keeps it. Oh, he's gonna, he's a good gonna lap, though. He's gonna have to go out and set a faster time than that. He's gonna risk the quality went. 
He has to go again. Yeah, no, it's a quality man. It's a quality man offensive. You say you're fast as fuck, where you're going off the track. He has to go again and improve on that time. Interesting. <laughs> but again, like, a, we'll deal with it after the fact. Like that's not something tidy, that we we'll do during the session. It's a. It was a tidy looking lap though. Bar that, aside from the wheel spin uh, in sector one, and then that obviously happening. That was like that's a pretty good lap time. Depends. If I don't know, I won't say anything now. We wait and see what happens. So basically, As, he's got to beat that lap time in order to yes. give himself a chance to. Yes. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Yes. Which he can do, Very but it's much. but it's not ideal because he should really be comfortable with that lap time anyway. But that's a lot of pressure. The fact he's gone off the track has not helped. Him. Yeah, yeah. I I think he will be listening. He knows that himself that you can't set your lap off the track. Oh, he's kind of struggling through the double left. He's been struggling with that all evening, as far as I know. He's a tenth down on rain through the middle, but he was a tenth up on rain in the first. Oh, he's nearly at the losing the rear of the car in the last little long corner there. Because up onto the stray comes Con. Is that Lavatory in front? Is that Maglox on an outlap? We'll say a motor Con here. Yeah, Maglox on Give him the lap. screen time. Oh, gets out of the way. Stay out of the way, Ferrari as well. Who's that Ferrari? Is that Moss Megan behind it? It is. Moss Megan, aka uh, Sonny Sanity Sanity's Fool. <laughs> He's on Xbox, is he? Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, it's Con nearly loses the car in the final corner. It's a tidy lap time, though. Not a bad. That's a good lap time. Very tidy. Look at this for tidy lap oh. times. Look at this someone, fella. Someone is angry that we are uh, Col- taking the piss out of his username. Colin B is a tenth and a half up through the middle sector. So what can he do? Oh, can Colin he improve B's looking middle? really good, isn't he? Can he improve in the last sector? He's going to have to find four tenths, another two and a half tenths in the last sector alone if he's going to take the original pole. Which he isn't going to do, but that's a sense of very Ooh. good lap time anyway. I see Sanko, Dylan, look at the Dylan fella, the Sandbags. times are dropping. His driving across the line, is a 10th down on rain, 50. Yeah, it's about that, yeah, a couple of tenths. He's lost, lost a lot of time that last second. Yeah, lost yeah. a fair bit. Daz is, no, who's that? Is that Farrell? Oh, Sanko staring at lap. Daz, uh, down in P11, I don't know if he's coming in or not, or if he's setting another lap. No, he's, he's coming great. in. He has time, he has time if he wants to come in and go back It's a reasonable lap time, at 31.8, like, and it's your first, it's a it's your first back. time back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that's a very, very good lap time. Sanko is on a lap. We're going board a Sanko here. P1 is three and a half tenths up through sector one, but a mighty, mighty sector one, actually, I have to say. Mm. That's an impressive sector one. Very impressive, I have to say now. But we'll go forward a little bit, I do believe. Is that Maglock's about to finish? Yeah, yeah he's three just tenths out, up. out of the final corner. <laughs> Takes it tended nice up through the final corner, but yeah, as you say, very nice. Oh, Very nice from Maglox. The man who, <laughs> apparently, according to his teammate, isn't feeling too comfortable, but we'll see. These are sweaty lap times, man. These are, <laughs> these are really good. <laughs> I this would actually hate to be out there at the minute, close, like, this is. Yeah. This is ridiculously close. People are uh, just... They, they that, can sense it's a chance but, to win a race, maybe. And, but what and, that time is, it's making people have to go out and use another set of tyres. Yeah. And which you don't want to do, well. really. At this, like, on a track like this, where... Now, with softs, it's not a good race tyre. Like, by any stretch of the imagination. It's yeah. actually a very bad race tyre. <laughs> but here comes Sanko, by the way. Round the final yeah. corner, looks tidy through there, I have to say. P1, 30.7. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> what am I saying? That's ridiculous, oh <laughs> man. <laughs> That's in Q2. They're going to improve by another 3, 4, 10 to least, I'd have to think. <sighs> That's, That's that scandalous. Uh, out comes rain. No. I actually, you know what? I actually don't think that 31.4 is a safe lap anyway. Look, yeah, look who's shows... below him. You have Raven, Saucy, Dan. You have Josh down there. His cable sticking in a lap. Seabooks, Farrell. Saucy and P10. Wow. Yeah. I don't... Wasn't expecting that now. But I you have so definitely... many below. Like, there's so many at risk here of not making it. So they all have yeah. to go out, I think. I don't think anyone's out, but there's a lot of lads staying in the pits here. Well, it's getting Rian's very late. Anyway. Rian, there's two Rian's minutes back out. 
Yeah, who's staying in? This so so far. Colin B thinks he's safe. I think he's safe also. Oh, do we? I don't know if Colin B is safe. I think that's a ballsy one from Colin. Yeah, a section it still is. hasn't come out. Section, section, I don't think it's fully really safe. Yeah, he won't be won't make it or else the section's finished. The Glocks is retiring as well. Josh is. Josh won't be. Josh won't be getting through either. He's finished. I tell you what, but so there's one more. Josh won't be making the two to kill three. He's saving a couple of tires. Daz is just out of lap. But the man we all want to watch it. It's Ryan. It is Ryan. I'm just gonna ride on board with Daz here for a second because I'm just yeah, curious. Yeah, I'll go to on board see. too. Ryan is not on a lap just yet, so. Oh, he's time still. Muscle. Yeah, he's lost that lap time. He's Daz dumb. is out. Why is he a kicker? Oh yeah, oh he's some. He's yeah, a just out of off. um. He's three out of that, that um. That oh, second yeah, part, the big curvy yeah. part. Yeah, yeah. You would have to say that's another one in Not so that's Josh finished. Daz realistically finished. Dan O'M is two tenths up, so mm. yeah, he has to improve. He is in the drop zone of Dan. Rian's on his lap at the moment. So I'm about to go on board. That's the sector split. He knows what he has to do. My God, that Ray really just Again, wants to slide yeah. out, doesn't it? That's a repeat of his uh, last lap, yeah. Same thing happened. He's tenth up. Nice. Oh, took that lovely. Yeah, that's really good. Took that lovely. But we'll come back, we'll come back to Rian. Few lads ahead who are in the drop zone. Farrell is just under a tent up, and oh, that's close. That probably is, will, will be enough to get him through at the moment. Like, so it's very close to, to make it through. Look at the gaps here at the moment. They're just so so close. It's ridiculous. If there's you a find, lot of like, sweat. That, yeah, there's a lot of sweat that's been going on. It's and Ryan is up again. Is that two, Dan? Oh, up. someone spun. Daz has spun around the final corner. Here comes Dan O'M for half a second up. Don't. Final corner, just wants to get around it. Final corner, true hook to the line. P2 for Dan O.M. Wow. As who, here comes Farrell, a man who is in the drop zone at the moment. So will he be making it into Q3? That's, that's his goal. Can he do it? Can he get into Q3? Oh, it's close. He's Not calling that. us the trouble can now. Here comes Rian. Here's Rian. Oh, he knew what to do, so didn't nice. he? He knew what to do, yeah. That's all right. <laughs> 40 point there, yeah. He done, he done, he knew what he had to do. Map. He knew he had to go back out. We'll go back yeah, on board yeah. with Khan, a man in the just on the precipice of going in or out now. Can he improve? I didn't see us any sector splits. He goes up to P4. Khan, what? Oh my god, where's this fella coming from? C books up to P5. So Raven is at risk, and Saucy. <laughs> Saucy's down here as well. Oh, with sections to the no. car at risk now. Oh, sections the car at risk. Sections out. Saucy's out. Saucy's out. Oh, no. <laughs> oh my, my god. god. That That's an crazy. unbelievable qualifying. Saucy so fair. rode that curb the whole way to the line. That was really what cost him in the end. Four thousandths is what cost him. That's really. That's what done it. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh man. If you want to take us down the order of it. All right, so we got uh, Sanko in P1, uh, Rian in P2, uh, Dano in P3, and Khan in P4, Seabucks in 5th, uh, Sandbags in 6th, uh, McLocks, uh, <laughs> Moss Megan, I'm not saying Sanity's fool, that's just <laughs> a criminal. Colin B and Raven West round up your top 10, and we lose... Uh, saucy, which is a huge. We lost section as well. How did I miss yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said it. Did I see it now? I, I, I just you. wasn't listening. I was just so <laughs> shocked. And then we got Farrell, Josh, and whoever was at the bottom. I missed the name, but um, that's that's crazy. So section. I mean, look, it's not the end of the world. But if you're like if you're reading at the moment, you are like feeling really good about yourself, even if you don't get pulled. Yeah. He's texting me there. He's, he's quite upset that he would have got a quality ban had that twenty point four been as fast as that. because yeah, I don't yeah, think I, he, I don't think he intended to go back out. By the way, no, I don't think I, so. I so don't think he did. Probably, you had to probably, use another set. Yeah, this is it. Like, but so, again, you, you 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 take these. You have to. So sometimes doesn't doesn't go the way you want. It is what it is. He, he set the quicker lap. He moves on. 
now he just might be at a slight disadvantage. I expect him to go out on a, a use uh, here anyway. As I tell you what, what a cute, that's an interesting lineup for Q3, isn't it? We lost, I see, we lost section. Farrell lost, Farrell sneezed, come around the final corner at the start of the lap yeah. and shit herself. So, like, we lost <laughs> Fanjo. Dills is there with it. Well, there's so many not making it into Q3 here this evening. It's crazy. Khan put in a great lap. Khan there. put in a that's very good lap. What, a 20.1 or something did he do? Yeah, like, that's ridiculous. Like, so really well done to him on that. Like, that's that's some going. Um, Raven, I'm actually surprised it's through. I definitely just, but uh, um, judging now off his Q1 and Q2, he didn't look mm. like he was totally comfortable, but uh, that's uh, that's another big one. But really, it's wide open now. It's really between, you would say between Rean and Sanko, but I mean, it's Dan OM, you just don't know. You just don't know. Um, it is extreme. It could be anyone. Sense. And then you got sandbags. Tough. He he put in a good lap as well. I don't know if he was in the, he was in the, um, if he got lower than the, uh, thirty ones. But uh, definitely it'll be interesting now to see. As Mag Lux is a force man. I expect everyone. Although Mag's tires look very new. I wonder has he gone out on a new set straight away? It's be interesting. That'd be an interesting strategy. Tells me he has another new set to come later on for another another yeah. one. So, yeah, a few of these would have saved the set from Q1, obviously. So, I wonder. It's actually really hard to tell. Um, the new tires are my guess, 100%. Yeah. Rian Rian looks like a, he's out on a new pair as well. Are they? Yeah, I think you're right. It's hard to tell. Yeah, I think, I, I think you're right. They look fairly clean. Do you know what's really crazy you... is the graphics in the F1 2021 actually look much nicer than they do now. I actually think is... everybody is out on uh, new new soft. I think which, so. I think they which, are. The fact that obviously the Q1 would have helped. I think everyone would have been able to save us there. Mm. So obviously they are all saved. The rear maybe, I don't know, we'll see. Time will tell. That's my clock. I, I just, it's just such a shitty complex of corners in my opinion. <sighs> For me. Piss, it's a major skill issue. But well, like that's the thing. It it really is like it affects everyone differently. I really struggled around here in um in season thirteen. I just I just couldn't hook it up. Like um I remember when we were racing Andy around here. Like it was he just he just excelled ah, around this here. Is like, his, I don't this, know. this track is his dream. It's yeah. just the traction. If he can get the traction down around here, and Andy's that's that's his specialty. It's, it's getting traction yeah, down. Like, yeah. Like and um, you know yourself, Andy. I thought he was all, his style just suited the strange tracks that not many people suited. This track this was his a, like, absolute dream. He just loved the, the traction difficult zone, uh, tracks. As I'm making out the squeaks here, I do apologise if you can hear that. <laughs> I thought my guys would have tried to get a cheeky little toe. Is he ever fuel? No, he's not. So I, I thought, very I, low. I thought was, yeah, no, he's alright. He's alright. Gonna be limping to the line anyway, or, or he's gonna As, be limping back to the pits anyway. I wonder, Sonny is, is Moss Megan on a bit of a scrubbed uh, slow lap because he's four tenths off Magdox through the middle sector at the moment. Let's see this lap. It's also, there. by the way, it's also one of the most difficult final corners. That's a ridiculous first lap. It's yeah, ridiculous for a banker, that's that's a good that's a good baseline. Um, Oh yeah, this that uh, that yeah. final what? corner is what? is honestly like just one and mistake and that's it. It's but over. Speaking of the final corner, Mas Megan are validating the final corner. As C Bucks is Ah oh, Max it out of the way. Good man. I was just seeing I seen a Ferrari come very close. As we have a few cars come around the final corner to finish the first lap, Dylan P two, Common P uh, Tody one A, so he's maybe on scrubbed. Dan OM coming to line, is he? He is. What can Dan OM set? Provisional pole, totally one flat. These are bankers, by oh. the way. Yeah, yeah. As here comes Rain. Rain is about to take that provisional pole away from both of them, I believe, if you can add this around the corner. Oh, we hit that nice. We did. This That's is going to be provisional pole. Yes, it is, oh. by three tenths of a second. Here comes Raven. Oh, Raven's off. He's half second off Rain at the moment. He's around Carla B, I think, through the middle sector, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong on that. So, Rian's 21 2 really good about this. Oh, even worse. Even worse. Rian is... Listen, I think he's quietly confident because 
Again, yeah. I had a chat with yeah. Ranger on the week. Rain, and he said it. He's been on the podium, I think, a couple of times this season. About, oh, about times he said, my season's over. And I had to say to him, like, you realise there's six races left, you're only 50 back. I know 50 mm-hmm. seems like a lot, but, like, you're only 50. Like, you're one race win away from sticking yourself right back in the thick of it. Yeah, but, like, and this is it. Like, I think he, he kind of misunderstood how how much was actually on the table for him. I said, here comes Sanko around the final corner. Can he set the marker for the session? Oh, a bit wide, you'd have to say. He's not going to like that. And, but, no, oh, not as good as Sanko would have hoped for. Yeah, yeah, a lot. There's a lot of time left a in lot, that. A like, lot, a lot of time. Half a I, second, probably, I expect at to the see, least. from Rain's time, I, I think Paul will be around the 30.3. Point four ish. I think Green can drop another three four tens on that to be honest with you. I'm gonna go for a point five. I, I think that's gonna be pole. Point five, um, interesting. I'll go lower. I'd say I I think Paul's gonna be about point three. Mm. But but man, like you're uh, you're right about uh Rian, like it's it's um you know, to go back not to keep going back to last season, but I mean look at section, like a couple of wins. And it Conf- right the confidence is ridiculous. Like. Yeah, and uh, you like that's the thing about Rian. Like he he's he has a great um, he has a great attitude. Like it's just you know he he probably is underestimating himself probably to save himself that kind of you know he, like you don't want to get your hopes up or anything like that. But I mean, like his pace last season at the end of last season was just it was just criminal. Like it was he- just so it was so unbelievable. Like and then it's like. It's just, it's not the same driver that, that we've seen mm. in these first few weeks. And I think that's the difficulty, is that, like, whatever it is, it's stopping him. It's really, it's kind of stuff that's a bit out of his control, I think. As I said in, in Saudi Arabia, he's just, he falls victim of that, like, wrong place, wrong time thing, where it's yeah. just, he's the one that, yeah. ha- like, he's the one driver in the field that is in the, he's just in the wrong place. But that's the thing, it's just, he needs to get these lap times and, and look what it can do for him. So, I mean, if he wins this race today, like, I mean, that is, that is some achievement, like, because it's it really has not been an easy start for him. It's been very, very difficult. No. So if he wins this, then it's really, like, as I said at the start of the stream, I think he has to. Like, there's no other option for him. If he is serious about this championship, this is where he's got to prove it today. Yeah. Couldn't have said about him myself, and I think he's listening. So no, no, no pressure. No pressure, right? Except yeah, yeah, all sorry, the pressure. Sorry to be, yeah. All of the pressure. With nothing else. Ah. Like, but speaking of, like, <laughs> we, everyone's going to be setting up. Uh, I'd say we have another good minute and a half before we see cars come out of the track for the final lap. Because nobody wants to yeah. buy first. Everyone wants to be the last car on the track to set the fact to have the best of the track evolution. We have a very interesting setup. Like, Q2 was ridiculously close. Like, the yeah. times, the, the, the gaps were just outrageous. I think, I think. Well, for half a second separated P1 to P15 or something like that, which is just bonkers. Like, it was something like something super like that, mm. which is ridiculous if you ask me. Ridiculous. I don't think I've seen a, a closer qualifying really going like either this season or last season. I can't remember a qualifying being as close as Spa what it was today. Was always, Spa was always close, but I don't, yeah, I don't think fair, it was this yeah. close. But I actually did. I did not expect this track now to to uh, give us those kind of lap times. I thought I thought the split would have been much I'll, bigger than this. I'll like, be honest. I, I the, the qualifying wise all season. I expect Austria to be the closest one all season times wise mm, because yeah. it, the I in saying that I expect the biggest discrepancy in tiers, but the closest within the tiers. I think each tier for qualifying in, in Austria specifically. It's gonna be psycho, like a so close, but like each tier you'll see the rise. Like tier two will set it will, will be that much quicker than tier three and tier one will be that much quicker than tier two, like. As it should yeah, be, yeah, like yeah. just by by like Newton's law, whatever law that is. <laughs> but like, you know what I mean? It's just one of them where that I wouldn't I just I wouldn't have expected it around the track like this, how close it actually is. As who's as that's that's Colin B, obviously it's gonna be the fourth man saying that. Yeah, it is. It's kind of an enigma. This track. We don't we, obviously real F one hasn't raced in a long time, and it's kind of it, we've raced obviously now two seasons in a row. I think haven't we? So the lads have yeah. gotten used to it. It's just it's not your tradi- It's a traditional race track, but it's not your traditional race track that we're used to, in a sense anymore. On this in this new era, we used to well, more. I'm sure Andy would tracks. agree. 
Uh, like I'm sure Andy would agree with me that it's probably uh, viable now to call this track like uh, like a classic old school yeah, uh, kind exactly. of track because 100%. that's the thing. Like when it was built at the time, it was like state of the art, but it it probably does provide a challenge for like mm, every driver 100%. in its own way. So like every driver is going to you know maybe go into it differently and approach it yeah. differently. But that's what you can't do on some of the newer tracks because it's just one way around it and that's it. But this track really is unique in that sense so speaking um, of unique Colin B is about to get us on their way it's Raven has let everybody go past them mm. on the main but anyway true tour 1, 2 and 3 come Colin B 289 can he have his best qualifying of the season time will tell we'll find out in the next minute and a half he is looking to be a Ferrari eight. I think Colin or I think it was Seabox was like really trailing behind Raven for some reason I think the two of them were like oh. Jockeying for who's going who's going to go last. Right, who's gonna go last? I believe that is Sanko. But anyway, Colombia has set a very good four sector. What can he do now? Can he what banker will he set for the lads to chase down? True the double left hander, which is so it's make or break really this little section. Make or break he's slightly tidy. tentative. Yes, yeah, tentative but tidy, I would say. Yeah. Like that's a good middle sector. That's a really good middle sector for Colin B. Can he get the pedal down? Oh, the rear wanted to step out a little bit, but he, he managed it. Gets the power down. What kind of car is he running in a straight line? Whoa. How quick is Colin B down the straights? I expect he's going to be meh, if that makes sense. 326 or so, I think that stopped that. Gets the car toned in beautifully to the second half corner, I have to say. It's such a hard corner to nail to get the turn in right as well. Round the final corner this. from Colin B. Oh. This is a very good lap, I have to say. 30.8 oh, P2. Provisional P2. Here comes Khan. Khan Con is two and a half tenths up on his own time, so he's on. Oh, he needs a really good last sector here. That's Khan. Is he invalidated? Actually, I do. Follow. I missed that. Ah, fair Who's enough. that? Is that Dylan? It is Dylan. He's only Dylan, just yeah. under a tenth up. He's not going to improve majorly here, Dylan. Not P3 bad. at the moment. Provisional P3. Dan O'M coming around the final, he's down. He's going to be into the pits, I think. Is that Rian? <coughs> yeah, it is Rian. Rian's coming through. He is a tenth and a half up. He is a tenth and a half up as Rian. And he sets a 30.5 oh, 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 is the is the mark. Here comes Moz Negan. Can he take it away from him? He can't go to P2 at a 30.8. Raven is coming around the final corner. Half a second up. He goes P4. Maglox. Where's Maglox? There he is. Tenth and a bit up. Jumps him up to P6, and that is Seabox. P7 for Seabox. And Sanko working, Sanko. Can he take Paul? He's half a second up. Can Sanko <laughs> trouble Rian? Can he take Paul? He can take Paul! He got it! <laughs> he can take Paul. Rian is going to be disgusted. Oh, <laughs> Rian is going to be absolutely disgusted. That was what mad. a lap. What a lap. What was the time? 20.3. I was right, so. You were right. I was... Look at the gap, Rian, man. Rian, Bra you let me down. I called a point five. Brandon, the, look at the, the gap from P three to P nine. That's crazy. That is that that's that looks really good. That that a should tenth make and a really half good separates race. nine separates eight positions. And speaking of positions, Sanko takes pole position around China, followed closely by Rian. Moz Megan is up there in P three. His best qualifying of the season. Colin B and P five also his best result. Raven P five. Dylan P6, Magdox P7, the two Tony Gar lads, Seabox P8, Dan O'M P9, and Con P10. What a qualifying. Are we, is this, is this going to set the standard for what we're going to see in this race, Brendan? I think so. And then uh, you factor in, we got uh, Saucy, Section, Fanjo. Outside and, uh, the top. Are all the way back then. So that's going to be like, that's going to be a challenge. But uh, interesting clear skies for the start I of the race. Pray. So. I pray to the F1 gods we don't get a safety car set. I pray. Yeah, I pray. Yeah. The lads are in such a good flow right now. Gang, give us a break. Give yeah. us a break. As lads are setting really their strategy. The, by the way, just for fun, the, what we do if there's a safety car, we do one restart of the lobby, and then we will do a safety car on a set, if need be. Okay. It's what, the, it's what the lads voted on, so I give the lads a fair bit of freedom to decide what way they want it to go. So this is the way they nice. voted it. Yeah, my God, I think we're in for a pretty intriguing race, Brendan, would you say? Yeah, a lot, like it's really a lot of different variables. Yeah, it's going to be up now. I would say 
it's gonna be it's gonna be tight now between uh, Sanko and Rian. I I would say Rian should have the advantage in terms of mm. race pace. I haven't seen a whole lot of Sanko now in terms of I don't know what to expect from him, but mm. he has put in some really good lap times. Um, I think Spy put in a really good lap time as well. I'm, I'm not too sure, but like, uh, it's really all about how can you do over a race distance and can you manage that yeah. car in terms of the tire temps and the pressure behind. So I would say Rian should be in a reasonable spot. Um, don't want to jinx him. I'm sorry, mm. Rian, if you <laughs> end up spinning. Uh, but um, yeah, it'll be fascinating now to see. And I'm just curious then about section as well. I think he's going to be a bit of an unknown I think in this race but he really needs this I think you know don't forget we have the championship leader down in the 11th yeah yeah so I wouldn't I wouldn't worry too much about go. Saucy oh, so. I, mean, oh I'm, I have a bit of a glitch on my screen uh oh we are go five we lights out we go as a safety we car are, yeah we are <laughs> good to go we are racing in China as Colin B is up the inside of a couple of cars here as Raven's trying to hang out around the outside of a couple of them also. Nobody wants to make the mistake in this little complex because it is a tough oh, complex. section. Oh, he's right in the middle of everyone. Wow. Oh, someone's someone's had a mistake there, I think. Might be C-Bucks, is it? There's a lot going on here. A lot going on. That's there's so chaotic. many cars wow. close to each other. Oh, there's Alf. Oh. There's an, who's that? Alpine, maybe? Was that Dylan on... <laughs> There's a I'm lot of sure. people. It's, There's a cow on the grass. A raven on the grass, I think. A Dan on, Dan on the grass. The sandbags oh. is falling way down the order. Oh, 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 oh. Seabucks is a Moss Megan. One of them is struggling. The one of the Ferraris is struggling. Has he got damage? Has Seabucks got damage? I wonder. might do, yeah, yeah. We have it yellows. Like we have a Haas. Saucy! No. Oh, my God. Oh, it's That's not huge. ideal at all. That is huge. If ever there was a, a chance for Section and Rian to get back into this championship, that is it. And also, uh, Dylan is way down the order as well, so oh this could be God. a complete reset. Look at the battery of Rian. He's bought half the battery in that lap. Now, is the that issue Andy is. driving the car, is it? Or... Sanko <laughs> is also on the medium, so if Rian. Is, there's a lot going on back here. This is a dirty out so corner much. to race with. There's so much happening. It's actually really hard to keep up, even. But, uh, Ooh. yeah. Section made an overtake down the outside of the corner, and up goes Farrell on the inside of his Williams teammate. Nice, nice move. Oh, he's going to try to send up the inside of Carl as well. Oh, someone's off the track. Who's that? That's Moss Megan off the track. Yeah, uh, Moss Megan, yeah, he's off. Dilzer. Oh, Dilzer and Farrell. Oh, what's that, Dilzer? Yeah, I just caught. I just caught I just that. Board. I just didn't, didn't know who it was. He's gonna uh, send out the inside. Farrell letting him through again. Yeah, he's letting him through. Interesting. Not sure what was going on there, but anyway, anyway. we'll go back forward as Rian has born a heap of battery up here. It's not ideal. You would have to say at this stage to have yeah, to burn that much. Yeah, it's a tricky one. But I think uh, you also like Sanko's on the medium, so Sanko's gonna be naturally quicker on that softer compound. Well, all Rian's got to do is just um, is, is literally there. just stay for one more lap, and that's it. He's st he stays in the DRS, and he can hang with him. Um, and basically, Colin B is not able to keep up either, so he's oh, a second off Rian. Yeah, he's at the game of three tenths on the last corner, though. So he's now in the DRS mm. of Rian. I think Rian's quicker in a straight line as well than Sanko, by the way. I, Rian just hit about three ten down the straight. Sanko was at three or three. Interesting. He's still got a. Oh, that sends battery. it! Oh my god! That has sent it up the inside of a couple of cars. <laughs> Fanjo would not happy be that. happy with that. Not <laughs> one bit. And, oh, set Josh is oh. around. Josh, no. He's beat. I think you can reset your beat. That's okay. Oh, he's on the oh, soft. He's on well, soft so as well. Oh Jesus! That's his. That's his wrist on. Oh, well, without a safety car, you would have to think so, yeah. But Rian no. has kept that gap anyway, so he's, he's staying within there. He's, he's really just oh got to stay God. with it. Dan is I would say it's okay. Dan is derating okay. and okay. he's not in the DRS. So Dan is... Oh right. Jeez, they're all derating. 
Yeah, Jesus they're all Christ. trying to stay within the DRS um, of each look, other. Look, That's look like... who hasn't borne any battery. Look at the P6 man there, Brendan. <sighs> Taking a very tactical run in this race is the man himself. He's actually had Raven, a bit of Yeah. Like, Raven is, like, he's he's just got to, like, kind of stay out of trouble. He's got to do himself a favor and just kind of not, like, get too into it or, like, or let the heat of the moment take over. He's got yep. great pace, and, and I think the more this race goes on, I would say the more he'll kind of settle into it, as you saw in qualifying. Because I was worried about him, but he's he's definitely settling into it really nice. Again, we know how quick he is. He's a mighty quick driver. Mighty, yeah. mighty quick driver. And I actually think I, I actually think for one, he'd compete for the championship. If, it, if again, he, whatever, 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 I can't even speak now. For whatever reason, <laughs> incidents happen with drivers. It's just... Yeah. It can happen with drivers every now and again where you just get wrapped up in an incident or two. And it happens, you make do. If he if he gets that fine tune to where you can manage that type of thing, he'd be a major contender here on tier one, I think. Major yeah. contender. And Colin has stayed in DRS as yeah, well. So. Colin's looking strong so far. We have yellows, that's Josh again. Oh. Josh, yeah. He's had them softs that finish anyway. I think we may hopefully don't see an early retirement, but we may do. Them them softs are fried. Main thing for Rian now is to just really settle into it and save his energy now because you have the DRS. Just don't, you know, don't make any move. That, don't do not do what I done the section and, and um, uh, go for it just because you think you can. Like, just let uh, let Sanko Johnson, drag you along yeah. as, as he's retired yet. So Very it's expected. like really for Rian, it's just, you know, keep it, just keep it tidy. Um, keep it on the black stuff. <laughs> yep, don't do I anything see. that you don't need to. And uh, that should be him looking fairly good for the race unless there's a safety car of course needs to build that battery up a bit more if you yeah, can yeah exactly they it's all a tough need track. To. it's a tough track to get the battery back though i will say but rain's in a good spot he's still in the drs on the supposed slower compound we have yellows ferrari c bucks he's around Ooh. safety car safety car oh he's out what oh no Oh, right. What do you do <laughs> if you're if you're? Do you stay out or? I think you stay you out. I think you stay I out. I think you have to. Yeah, yeah. I can't believe what I've, Sanko is <laughs> staying out. I mean, it's in. Oh yeah, yeah. Is he the Oy. only one? No, Mags is in. Dylan's in. Oh, I'm not over it. I'm not. I'm not fond of that. I know what he's doing. I know exactly what he's doing. But. Whether I'm fond of it is a different story. C books is left. But you remember that? Uh, but you remember what Fangio the done? Um, he decided to pit and and you know be on the fresher rubber, and you could see what he was doing. But then if there's a safety car, it's like. Oh, and the and the, the issue now mm -hmm. is if there's an if there's a soon safety car soon, Rain's in a tough spot. So I, I mean, gonna... I, look, we know what he's thinking of here. Now we're thinking of a medium medium strat, obviously. Yeah. But. I don't know. He has to make that walk really, really quickly, if you ask me. He has to get past, past that pack in front of him, like Daz, Dilza, Farrell, Sexy. He has to get up to them and yeah. get past them realistically. So this brings a uh, section into it as well. So sections up in the P6. And I think he had a really bad start as well. He, he was really in the thick of it with everyone in, in the first corners. But um, if I'm section right now, I'm feeling a lot better about myself and and just keeping that that same mindset of just you know and i think section he he does tend to burn the battery quite a bit as well for no real reason so i think that's he's just got to make sure he keeps up with the top guys but i think for i like i i think looking at colin b i'd be worried about him keeping up with sanko because i'd say sanko's gonna run away with it at the moment um, well, just judging by his pace. I'm very intrigued now with, with the lads who on the mediums who stayed out because look, the, the likes of Rian and Magdalene now are going to be quick. Yeah. They are going to be quick. And oh, I don't know. That's how they're shaking things up. I actually think c -Bucks is quite unlucky because he tried to rotate the car and again, it's similar to what happened to Rian in Australia. I don't know if you remember that, what he got his quality band for. Different circumstances yeah. obviously, but Seabox has tried to turn the car around and he's given the wall a tap but it's not enough to take a wheel off the car yeah it's just really bad with the contact model so 
Um, I did see that happen before um, in, in the last league I was part of. Uh, I think it was a guy, basically, he just was literally reversing his car and lost one of his rear tires just by uh, tapping the barrier. I've never seen a rear tire come off. Of. Yeah, it was, it was ridiculous. Like, he just tapped the wall ever so gently and the car, and it just, it just DNF'd and caused a, a whole mess and with a safety car, which was quite entertaining, though, watching on, on the live stream. I'd say so, yeah. <laughs> um, but no, it's it's a it's an interesting one. I, I just hope Rian knows what he's doing. I hope he knows like what this can lead to or or what's coming up. But um, because if he plans on overtaking people, I I just don't know. It's a it's a massive gamble. <laughs> you're you're putting like you're putting other people's race, uh, or you, like you're you're giving your race. If I can Allow. find the words. <laughs> No, no, but it's like it's putting your own race in the hands of other people. If you get me, you know, you're if you're planning to overtake a lot of people, you're you're like trusting them to be able to keep it clean and and to get through like nine drivers, like that's not always going to happen. So, so yeah, no, yeah. no, no. See, the thing is now he's he doesn't have to get past nine now because he's obviously two stopping onto mm. like if this race from here on out goes no safety cars and he's to do a medium medium, he is gonna be ridiculously quick all oh, things going mm. well for the last thing by the way Paddy was just saying that he thinks Dylan may go try all the way to the end on them heads I will be blown away if he makes that walk tyre dag around here is mm. ridiculous ridiculous mm. honestly if he goes all the way on that he, he can have to win as far as I'm concerned <laughs> yeah well anyway we're about to get on the way we have Sanko leading us away on the safety car he says get building a juicy old gap to that safety car isn't he he sent that thing get away well, well as long as he doesn't do an andy and, and start uh, <laughs> oh he's just fired uh... just fired <laughs> oh andy i wouldn't be having that Andy, get in here we need a knock two naughty that's having a scrap <laughs> wouldn't be having that safety uh... car he's about to leave us sanko's gone yeah, sanko I'm... is gone is he gonna catch his he's gonna catch his safety car isn't he Oh, is he? He's, oh, he's just going to make already. it. He's just going to make oh, it. Oh, wow. got away with that. That was close. Yeah, that was very got close. Got away with that, didn't he? So, uh, Colin, uh, right now, like, he is probably on the better tire at the moment. I would rather mm. be on the hards now versus at the start. So, Colin really just has to focus on, he's got to do what Rian done. And if he, Stay if he finds Sanko, yeah, just burn that battery. Like, But I, I think if you're the guy oh. in P2, you can afford to burn that battery a bit more, but it's come already. Come on, back down to P10 here, Brendan. We're gonna have a move. Rain is up to P9. Oh, Daz is trying to hold it. Is Daz no. feeling generous? Oh, yeah, no, has no choice. Rain is born, and Rain is born, and he knows. He has to make some moves now. He doesn't have to make all the moves now. Yeah, so yeah. Well, he needs to manage it slightly. He needs to manage this like smartly. He really does. We'll see what he can yeah. do. Connor's after smacking the curb on the inside, and oh, now section's gonna be all over him. <laughs> Oh, Dilzer almost lost it in front of Rian there. Rian's about that to go up the inside, I think, isn't he? Oh, he's trying to oh, break late. Oh. oh! See, this is what I mean. It's like, oh, no, Daz is, is right there as well. Oh, Daz is gone. Oh, wow. He spawned that. Another... There was no contact. No, they oh. didn't touch. He just lost on traction. Don't do what <laughs> Seabook did. And now Dilzer's already 1.2 off okay. of Farrell. Ah, so, chill. yeah. I'll get that back. They get it all back in the breaking zone. I'm not worried about that one bit. Oh, we have contact all over the place in the second last corner. Moss Megan, a Franjo touch. As Rian is insane. all out. Rian is born in the battery. He's gone straight past the other here. Yeah. Straight yeah, past. He has to. to. Now he has to. Yep. Now he has to go. The gaps are there. Dills are, oh, there's a thought about hanging up the inside. Magnus going oh. to the inside of Dills as well. Oh, McGlock's just absolutely mugged Dilzer there. He just did he make the move? He did as well, didn't yeah, he? Yeah, he brilliant snatched move. that brilliant. off him. Talk about opportunistic, opportunistic overtake there from uh, McGlock. Absolutely, yeah. Follow Great through. Job. As look at the front three, a mighty, mighty close here. Dano M has not burned an ounce. Sorry, looking at neither of them are burned battery really. Oh, it's all so Colin. close. Rain, Rain's gone up the inside of Farrell now. He's up to B seven. I don't think Farrell Beautiful. put up a major fight there, though. Farrell is going deep with these at the moment. And now Section's a different story. Unless Section oh. isn't really feeling up for it, but 
Section's always a difficult driver to get through one way or another, so he won't make it easy on Rain. As Magdox with the inside of the foul as well. Dills has had that clobber in the court, the curb out of it as well. Dills at Fando. Just fighting Dylan. Oh, Dylan's nearly gone. Oh my god. Yeah, Rain's not going to make the move past the past uh, section just yet. He Might thought about burning that battery, but he, he, he did. He hasn't got much more to burn, to be fair. <laughs> nah. As DRS is about to be activated. Well, Colin's Fanto, done really well to stay has, with, with Sanko. What's the battery situation up there? Sanko's won the lock. Raven is on full battery. Yeah, he's, and he's sitting on, in there behind his teammate. As he's Rain, technically on Rain worse is, tires as well. Rain is now derating. Rain is now derating. He's trying to go up the inside. Of oh, the two of them. He do, makes the move pass. Section lets him have it. Oh. oh. Gave, he gave to us they gave to respect to each other. <laughs> oh corners have a wobbles everywhere. Is Rain gonna switch it up the, the outside? Oh Worst he's thing. getting a squeeze, he's getting a squeeze, alright, isn't he? Yeah. I, I think Corrine's Corrine. just gotta give this up for now. You, you can get him at another he'll part of the track. He'll make the move, he's... no doubt about it. Yeah. You get him in the DRS here. Daz gets the track limits. As the two the Mercedes section. are now fighting, by the way. Rain needs yeah, to be patient Yeah, Section here. has been saving his battery nicely as well. He's on 40% at the moment. Um, How about that battery to defend this? Rain is going to walk past Khan now in a second. Needs to buy this time. But Glocks may make this move. No, he won't. You know, I think you'd be mad to make it now. Look, make it with the DRS. Yeah. Will, the, will we see a Mercedes swap, by the way? The boat born it. The boat born it. With, as Rain's Colin to go for this now. Ah, yeah, you walk past him. Look at the gap. It's Con Bourne. Then Con is more battery. Con is a rocket ship in a straight line. That's what's going on there. Oh. Who can I hope break that? I think Green's going to make that move. It's going to. It's hard. Just don't. 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 Con, don't hold it. Yeah, he's giving it up. That was smart. I think Green had to. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, anyway. Where's it? Raven and Dana Lambert. My my voice is really croaky here, by the way. You probably hear it. I noticed, yeah, at the on. start of the stream, were you, uh, were you doing lots of work <laughs> last night uh, during the race, yeah? Sections up the inside of Khan, by the way. No, 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 I just, I've had a sore throat all weekend, so it's uh, one of them. Fair enough, yeah. A section yeah, in Khan, no section and Khan, section tires in the better spot at the moment. Yeah, that's that move is going to be done. Khan Khan that up and watch oh, look, who's this? Mads up the inside now. Yep. Oh, gave section a little kiss of the rear, but not major. Nah, Rain right. is now on the back of Raven shortly, and he has a gap behind, which is key at the moment. You would have to say. So but he's then, not in a good spot. Battery was. He's in the worst spot. No, top five on his battery. No, but that's so, it. As he he's got himself in there, and, and I think if, now. if if he makes the strategy worse, then Oof. then I am a fool. I mean, I I, I didn't know. I, think, I personally think it's a good how strategy. How good this would go say. for him. Yeah, yeah, I didn't know how good this would be for him now. It's looking really good. But, but again, now, do, does he choose the spots? Does he tuck in now and let the kind of... Let these lads have the box now. But so does he as yeah, well. Yeah, they but, do. But so does he as well. He can go the few laps longer and not lose too much time. He has a major gap behind, by the way. As Fanjo... Oh, Raven was up the inside. Oh, Is that going to... No. Sections at the top of Maglox, I think. He gave himself a little spin. Oh my Mercedes god, are in, are Oh, this is a mess. Oh my god. They're going three wide. Back there by someone. Yeah, they got over. Yeah, Rian's just gonna. <laughs> he, he. Rian's trying to make the it stick. Yeah, oh, yeah, but Jesus. He's... Oh, Jesus. This is ropey. The two Mercs are not making this easy. This is ropey, man. I'm petrified just watching this. Yeah. I am petrified dropped. just watching. Is Rian gonna be trying to be up in the news to kill? I think the Mercedes are gonna, gonna fight, aren't they? Oh, Rain drops right around the outside. <laughs> what a move if he makes it, but I'm not sure if he's going to have... Oh, is he going to make it? What a move. Yeah, Has he, he made should it? do. Yeah, oh, he's dead. Brilliant move. Brilliant. What a move. Brilliant overtake. I, I thought he, he missed past. his... Saucy and Dylan, side by side through the long way. You don't want to be side by side through there. I'll tell you that. That's, that's right, we've forgotten about Saucy. He's, and, and Sandbags he's is staying with him as well. Rain has made progress here, but Dan is going to be eager to get back ahead of him here. And maybe Rain shouldn't fight it too hard, you would say. But now Raven's going to be going at the P2. 
Yeah, he will. Connor B has no DRS assistance. I'm amazed now Collins dropped off because he should be on the better tire at the moment. Like, yeah, and Raven is about to go through. Yes, he is. Yeah. Well, Rain follow. Rain's gonna well. follow. Rain's gonna follow. He has to. Yeah, yeah. Carl's gonna get out of it, isn't he? Yeah, I think he is. Yeah. Is he? He is. Yeah. yeah he will. Section up the inside of Saucy. Saucy's gonna try hang around the outside, is he? Oh, the got section got out of it. That's how it comes Dylan Again. now. Two two uh, drivers you would be uh, you would presume are fighting each other for the championship. Yes, P ten and P nine at the moment. Oh, who's that? That Maglox uh, and Dan O'M having a scrap. Mags has passed. Yeah. No, he's not yet. He's not there. He's not there That's, yet. It's oh, all happening. oh! What happened? How in God's name did Dan O'M catch that car? <laughs> I said this last week as well. He had a ridiculous speed and wobble. Oh my god, I don't believe what I've just seen. As Dylan and Sandbag, Dylan and Sandbag, Dylan and Section. A section, oh, Section. Oh. It's all happening. There's so was, much going on. That was nearly catastrophic, by the way. Until Section decided to back out of it. Mm. Anyway, I think we're going to see a bit of settling down, maybe, of the front few. I would say they would have to eventually, because it's all Mag been... is a man just... eager, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Mag's definitely he's gotta make this move now and call and he if he can stay with Rian he's he's definitely in there, he's well in the hunt like He's going for it. Do. Yeah, Carlo's not born it. Yeah, Mags doesn't really need to burn the battery. Is Rian going, going for it? No, he's not. Oh! He's derating them. Oh my god. He had to go deep there like last minute. I wonder now, will Dan O'M... Oh, Rian goes Rian wide. Rian goes off, yeah, see that. Don't think he'd cost himself too much, so he didn't gain anything either. Oh, look at the speed he's got down that straight, oh my god. I'm worried, I'm just worried, I'm worried for Rian at the moment. I, I just, I'm, it just, I, I feel he is the most to lose out of every yes. driver on this, in this race today. Like, and, and you just, you don't want to be in that position. Um... But he is on the fresher tire, and he's done really, really well thus far, and he's proved me wrong thus far, which, uh, which is great. But um, oh, I'm just, I just don't, I, I just don't want to see him um, mm, come out on on the wrong end of anything. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. We have two seven car trains going at the moment here, by the way, Brendan. <laughs> which is Lovely. ridiculous if you ask me. Like, we've got two so separate got two... races going on. We got two two uh, tiers within one tier, is what you're saying. Pretty much, at the yeah. moment, that's the way it's looking. <laughs> As Fando is now on the back of Dan O'M trying to make this work. My God, everything's happening. It's you have crazy. To think, it's... Sanko and Raven are surely looking at a pissed up soon. Like, their mediums, are, like, I, I know we had the safety care, but their mediums. Let's see. <laughs> uh... I, I think we'll see Raven in soon try for an undercut. Let me see. Because I know, what did, oh, Raven's oh, Rian's going of... through. Interesting. Yep. Very interesting. Rian well, wanted to get past. Well, yeah, it's smart by Raven because uh, you can you use Rian now. If you're not pitting, you can use Rian to uh, drag you along. He's pitting, as, he's pitting, yeah. he's pitting. No, yeah. no. Who's that? Well, Sanko's in, Sanko's in. Uh, Sanko's pitting, yeah, yeah. Oh, so... that's like shooting Rian in the foot. <laughs> that's not ideal for Rian, I don't think, right now, having Sanko pit. I think you would have liked Sanko to stay out. So what do you do now? So you just stay out for a few more laps if you're Rian. And, Rian can afford and, to stay out. Raven yeah. and Colin and Dan may may have to look at a pit stop. Oh, Rian is pushing now. He can. He was losing oh, he the is, rear yeah. end there. Oh yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. Raven is pitting this up. I think he has to respond to Sanko. Has to. Has yeah. To. Yeah. Like Rian, can Rian use... can't afford it because he has such fresh tires. Yeah, but this it, yeah. is what's good now by Raven. He can use Rian. If he can stay in DRS, that is, he can use and gain that time back on Sanko in the pit stop. And So, yeah, this is good by Raven. I like this. What's the gap to the leader? Let's have a little look. So, Sanko is 21 seconds off the leader. I'm not sure what a pit stop is. But I'd imagine he's still in that P1 once everything's said and done. He has a lot of free air as well to work with. Where was he? He's a ton of free air. Oh, I thought Dylan had a wobble. Well, okay. 
I think everything's about to start unfolding, Brendan. We have Dylan on his lovely Irish hand helmet. <sighs> Are we about to see a lead exchange? I don't believe so. <laughs> I think we're going to see a piss stop, though. As Fan John Brendan, not Fan John Brendan, you hear me? Fan John <laughs> Dan about to have a knock. Dan gets out, we're going to see piss stops. Surely, Bre Raven's not in. Oh, Raven stays out. Oh, wow. Okay. Bars. Yeah, yeah. That's bad. And, and Rian is still and Rian is still D rating as well. So like I, he hasn't he hasn't lost time though. If you look at it, like no, yeah, he's mm. also on the sign. Oh, who's this? Maglock's up the inside of Raven. Where'd that come from? Oh, 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 oh Raven. Oh just my stay god. With him. Oh yeah, my just, god. He's just got to stay with it. He doesn't need to <laughs> race him. Just that was a major wobble. That was a major <laughs> wobble. He's not fresh at all. Yeah, he doesn't. He didn't need to fight that hard, did he? Yeah, yeah. It was so wise Raven to get now, out. Of it. Wise to get out. Raven's of it. got a pit now. I think that's. Yeah, that's, he has, he's going to be falling back with like, His tires yeah, are in bad. Man. Bad nick now. One hundred percent over sixty percent on R four. No doubt in my mind. He's probably done a a good hard stint on these mediums at the moment. Yeah, he's done well. Of, like, he's done well to be fair. Yeah, yeah. But the issue now is he, he's come down, done kind of a backwards because now he's to go on to. The head of compounds for a shorter period of time, which I never like doing, it just doesn't make sense. I mean, it's 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 more so about you know getting that uh, getting that undercut and just making that mm. time up. And speaking of under, where's I mean, Sanko? Oh, Sanko's gaining. It. Sanko's a cool, easy nap he wanted to mount. He's eight. He's gaining three seconds on rain in the last lap or two. Wow, which is major, well. by the way. But again, look at the amount of clear air he has. He's so much free air at the moment. Yeah, yeah. Well, Rian just has to. Like you will make that time back up on the mediums, yeah, I'm sure. 100%. But he's but but Rian's just got to time it perfectly. Like just surely Raven's in. A lap in, too late. In. Raven's yeah. in. Yeah, he's got to. And Collins in. Dan oh, O'M stayed out. Fanjo's up into P3. <laughs> of course he is. <laughs> <laughs> Cheeky bugger. <laughs> uh, These three are in a party, Dan actually, by the way. Yeah, Dan O'M's done really together. well as well, and Dylan, Dylan's hanging in there. I think Dylan's done a really good race for himself. He's, Where's Sanko coming He's had in? a good recovery. Oh, he's miles ahead of Raven. Wow. He's miles ahead of him. Oh, Rain has to box. Surely. What's the gap, yeah. to, what's the gap to Raven? Six seconds. Oh, he has to box in, surely. That's crazy. Oh, Raven, how? Oh, Raven's got soft. That's it in the pits. <laughs> Raven's got socks. socks. They're gonna be crippled. Oh my God! Here we go. Who who was the driver in tier two oh last night that, that won the race on socks? Panther King. But, Panther King. He, yeah, but that's the thing. Uh, Lucky Not Shot was on hards uh, yeah, behind yeah. him, and the time at a certain like past lap five or lap six. <sighs> The hard tires, which were five laps older, were equal to the soft tires yeah, yeah, yeah. in terms of overall pace. So as Magdox gonna take the lead of the race here, by the way. I think that one of these is pitting if I'm like I'd be blown away if one of them now pit. Yeah, I think so too. Because you just I think you need oh. every lap you can. Oh Rian Jesus. You just need every lap you can. If I'm if I'm Rian, I'm going for it now. Just go for it. You've no, you've staying got out. to no, he's staying is, out. Is he thinking? Is he thinking of Soft as well? Soft won't be that good for that long, man. No way. No, man. No way will they be. Like, they surely have to know that. They know That's it's a high deck circuit. As Rian yeah. is all over the back of Maglox, by the way, all over the back of him. He needs to be very careful there. You don't want to do anything silly at this stage. Not with the amount on the line here at the moment. Like you don't want to do something silly. A Sanko is flying. Yes, he joined it. That's the, like, softs are absolutely rapid when you force put mm. them on. It's the issue after four or five laps, they drop off quick. Like, really, the drop off from softs is, like, ridiculous. Like, Raven hasn't actually gained much on Sanko at all there in the last two laps. And Sanko's on yeah. heads. I think, I don't think softs is, is the call here. I think you go on another set of mediums. And because you, you're what, it's all well and good having having pace at the start of at the start of a stint. You need pace at the end of a stint as well. Yeah, that's it. Like, and and you need to have that confidence in exactly. the car that it it's at least going to keep you on track. Like, because if you don't have that, it's awful. Like, it's absolutely horrible. Didn't sit there in the head. Is he? I wonder. Is he actually thinking of trying to go to the end on them? I think he'd be crazy. I think they're already struggling. To be honest with you. 
Well, Sanko's eight <coughs> seconds off him at the moment, and eight he's already seconds. made his pit stop. So, mm, no, I, 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 I think if I was uh, Dylan, I would probably Shorty, either you extend. The Mag's in. Mag yeah. in. Yeah. We'll see these two oh, in the he, next go, he goes wide there as well. Jeez, ah, you can do that in the pit then. Yeah, you can do that in the pit then. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm, that's what I'm saying, John. Oh, Sanko's ha Raven hasn't actually made a big dent on Sanko. Sanko looks very strong at the moment. What's the gap to the leader? By my guess, Sanko is going to be about... What's he? Well, I can't see the gap. Give me a sec. 13 seconds behind Dreen. Sanko's going to be very... A long way in the lead here when all the piss offs are said and done. Like yeah. a long, long way in the lead. I think he's going to be nearly 10 seconds. To, sorry, nice. I say to in the I say to Rean, the, the gap to Rean is going to be about ten seconds. I think. Where's the gap to Mags? It's, Mags is on mediums now at the moment. He's, he's, he's got ten seconds back to Maglox. That's crazy. He's wow. got ten seconds to Maglox. Mags that is on mediums, mental. by the way. Just quick, quick, quick FYI. I think we see Rean in now onto mediums. I think he has he, to make. Yeah, he has he needs to. to give, yeah. He needs to give himself the time now to make to make the positions. But he's also he's surely boxing mm -hmm. into traffic now as well. What's the gap? So I'll say pit as well. Uh, sections down in P10. So yeah. Rain will come out, I think, somewhere <laughs> behind Colin B, maybe. Just in front of Maglox, I think. Yeah. But he has to, I think I think he has to go now. What do you think, Brendan? I think he yeah, I mean either that or he's Sanko's he's gaining out. hand over fist on him. <laughs> hand over fist he's gaining. Yeah. I think the gap to Rain from to Sanko is gonna be at least ten seconds. I think we're gonna see them both in there, Rain and Fanjo. Yeah, he's in. Rain's in, Fanjo's in. Dill might hold on to a podium. I think them, nah, John, I think the heads are going to fall off a cliff, to be honest with you. The, the issue is how long, and what's the gap going to be? What's the gap going to be? Here comes Sanko. He's got to be, oh my God. What's in that lead here? Are they coming, are the two boys coming out of the pits yet? They're not, they're only getting into the pits. Oh my God. Ravens on the cup, out of them. Wow. Oh my god! Fangio's just come out behind. Like, oh wow! Oh, Green's behind section. He's been under a couple oh. of night as well. Oh, Fangio hit Con as well. Oh my god! Oh, that's not ideal for Fangio. He's really, oh, he's gonna hemorrhage time here behind Con. He's got it before. He's, he's got just, a bonus. He's yeah, go straight past I, him. Con's letting. Us I can't believe how far back Green is. What's the gap to Sanko for Green? 12 seconds! <laughs> that is nuts. That is just... <laughs> that is criminal, the amount of lap time. So now, really, wow. it's, it's a case now of... of um, Dylan is, might hold on to a podium after all, actually. Whoa. I mean, you never know. Like, he's got four seconds. He's lost maybe two seconds, maybe in the last two laps, I think. Um, so he'll probably be losing a second a lap at this stage, I would say. Like, it's definitely a... It's a, it's a that's a lot of time that he's losing, like. Um, but man, this this race is like it's either really crazy, like, like long, drawn out, boring, or it's really like just captivating with the strategy. Oh, and my God's passed on away for P four, P five. I think that safety car just completely threw everything out the window in terms of strategy. I'd say. Just, uh, just the timing of it couldn't have been worse. I'd say for Rian, in my Bre opinion. Brendan, can you do me? A, can you check Dylan's lap times? You know, once in a while, what is what's Dylan's lap times? You know how to do that? Um, if you go, if you pause and go race director and click on Dylan and view lap times. Ah, there we go. What is he doing in the one thirty? What's he, what's he lapping? You know, once in a while. So right oh, now Farrell's he's uh, one thirty seven point one, thirty seven point one, thirty six point nine. Yeah, so he's so, losing probably. He's in the high thirty sixes. So yeah, that goes to yeah. tell you, Jenna. I don't think Dylan's quick enough to hold on. I think them tires are gone. I'll be honest. I think they're gone. We lost Farrell in that melee there. And then we've got Sanko doing 35-1 and 35-2. Yeah. By the way, Fanjo got past Rian. Wow. Fanjo's on soft, by the way. I've also just copped onto that. Fanjo is going to be a rocket. No, oh, it's, 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 it's Farrell's yeah. a tire car. Is Fanjo going to send up the inside now? Oh, he is! That's going to let Rian in. That's going to give Rian a look. Rian's got to work together here. 
Yeah, he's got a good amount of battery built up as well. So Don't burn it now, that's um, surely. You let these moves ahead of you happen now, and then you pick off the pieces, surely. Am I right in saying that? Or... Well, I mean, Section's got a lot to fight for as well, so like... Oh, I Section's say not going to move over, not by a long shot. No, no way. He's got himself into a position now where he can at least get something back, like, so I would expect him now to hold on to it like a, a guy like a maniac at the moment. But in saying that, though, uh, Fanju does look... He, he should Racy. have the fresher rubber. Yeah, yeah. Racy. I think Fanju's not I, I afraid. No. Oh, 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 is he going oh, up? Oh, yep, oh, he's oh, going oh, up oh. the inside. Yep. <laughs> oh, if he makes you a stick, what a move. He should make a stick, though. He should with them stuff. He does. A... Great move. Great move. What a crafty hurt. Now really. Rain has to move. <laughs> now Rain has to go. Yeah, yeah. Section's D rating. It's fine, Joe's D rating. So, Rain can see this. He knows what to do. A podium is on the cards here for Rain. Man, Saucy's nowhere. He's behind it's Rain, he's falling back, yeah, it's not ideal. But he's D-rating as well, yeah. he's on 10% battery, that's not oh, good. Oh, Rain is so much quicker at the moment, Brendan. Yeah. You can see it through the corner, how much time he's actually pulling. And Sanko's about to have DRS on his teammate up the straight. That's how quick Sanko's been, and that's how slow Dylan's been on them tires. He's not going to have DRS yet, I don't think, but is he? No, he won't. <coughs> but Dylan won't stay in that way, Dylan won't stay in his way there. No way, they'll play the team game there. Uh, as the they blocks, should. They're getting past Dan away. As now. Reigns about to go past section. No DRS. Oh, with, oh there is DRS for section. Then this is going to be a fight because these are fighting for position. The section's going to try to hold around the outside, by the way. Is he? Oh, he got over, did he? Switch back. Is he trying oh, to switch back? Switch back. <sighs> Tapped him on the rear, but nothing to it. The main Fra thing for section now, he's just got to stay with the Fra 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 trying to make a move on the main straight. Oh, past Dan away. He's born and he's born and on 0%. Dylan, where's Raven? I'd, I'd say Raven is P3. Them sauce are falling quickly. Colin's gaining now on Raven. Oh, 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 Raven nearly lost the car. I think they nearly oh, lost it as well. I think them sauce are gone, Brendan, on, on yeah. Raven's car. I'll be honest, I think the sauce are gone. Uh, Fanju had a massive uh, tank slapper as well, so uh, he's also really struggling at the moment. He's only three lap old tires, so. I got also the dirty air effect. I think it's playing a part here. <laughs> Franjo's practically inside Dan O'Ham's gearbox. I wonder. Ooh. I wonder with the weather. Is it just getting a little bit darker it looks on dark, track? But I don't think it's dark enough that's going to yeah. have an impact. Now again, I don't know. Let's say let's say the rain does come now. Like what's the tire? Like I. I I, I never understand. Like, the, is old tires that bad to be on in the rain? Um, I'm actually not sure. Well, obviously, you want to be on uh, younger What's tires. It like, just it has more. Um, it's still a fine it's teammate. Gonna... Dylan's fine. Sanko. He's not. He's not. You got out of it. Sorry, Brenda. Sorry. Dylan looking like no he was going to try switching back. I sank. Found your mate to move into P6 past Dan. Now Rain has to make some moves because he's running our laps. It's a tricky one with uh, with Dylan at the moment, isn't it? Like it's kind of has he got I, enough I, laps to hold off? Well, nah, right. I don't think so. the, the thing is now he's got a lad behind him whose tires are also gone. So I think mm. Dylan might might be able to nick a podium. Do you know? What, like I don't know. I'm not sure because you have Maglox there looking quick, and he's only got four four and a half seconds back off Dylan at the moment. So. Okay, old heads, disastrous in the way. I thought I wasn't sure because there's such a confusing thing in this game where certain tires are really good in the way. You can go with sticks in the way easily and I don't know. But yeah. Mm. Rain hasn't made a whole lot of progress back there yet. He's just kind of stuck. You'd expect him to maybe turn up the aggression a little notch or two soon. Oh yeah, he's so much quicker and down through that double left as well. And then he the right. break just uh, that much later as yeah. well. Yeah, oh! Colby nearly lost it. Maglox is going to be sniffing that P4, isn't he? And then he's going to be on the back of Raven very quickly, I'd imagine. <laughs> Raven's closing on Dylan quickly, by the way, uh, Brendan. There's a P2. I'd say the rain will come. I would say the rain's coming it's very looking soon. It's very you know? dark. It's looking very dark. It's just gotten a little bit more darker, isn't it? Maybe the sun's a little, just a tiny bit out, but it, it definitely looks like it's threatening. I do remember, Jono. I do remember. As Fanjo has also gone past both of them. <laughs> 
Watch Ryan, oh watch Ryan. God. Where is go, he? Go He's got Ryan, damage, go. hasn't he? He got damage. <laughs> oh. He didn't, he didn't. I don't know. Who was he tapped, Colin? He, I think he, he tapped he Colin. Colin. He tapped Colin, yeah. He's oh, seen, no, it, he's he, seen I, an opportunity. He's seen an opportunity. And I mean, I look. think it's okay. I think it's okay. He looks like he like we'll see now in this next uh, series of corners how if he does have wing damage because you'll definitely be able to see it. Like, but no, he looks okay at the moment. That was oh, Christ. you can tell now he's eager. He's eager yeah, to make these Yeah, yeah. He's gonna, he's, he's gonna, gonna yeah, look at him. He's gonna go past Colin Bean now. We're on the outside. Oh, I should have went up the inside. Switch back. Go on. No, Colin blocked him off very well. Yeah, Colin he, blocked he that off very well. He should have just kind of pulled the car out left and then just tried to dart it up the inside, up um, up the inside of Colin Ooh. because going around the he's outside. He's gonna go up the inside of Colin works. now. He's going up the inside of Colin. Go on. He has to. Go on. That's yeah. good move, great good move. Man. Opportunistic, man. opportunistic. Yeah, he yeah. has to be running into the DRS. DRS is vital now for him. Crucial, but yeah. He can make a lot of progress here in these last couple of last but he has to stay in the DRS. And I think he will. I think he will. Colin won't be happy with that tap. No, he definitely won't, because that was definitely a, that was a big hit. I'm amazed Rian doesn't have any damage out of that. Uh, yeah, so like, more. He, like Honestly, oh, right. that was... Find John Raven, find John Raven. Find John made him think about it. Find John made him oh, think yeah. about it. I think it was just a slow little tap in the ass, wasn't it? Dylan's hanging in there. Like, I mean, he the is. softs are he catching, is. but like, it's not, not as much, anywhere not near as, much. as bad. Yeah, yeah. Right. The guys, um, uh, the guys the in the mediums will be... The, um, the guys in the mediums will be really... As soon as they get past, they'll be right on Dylan. Like that's that's gonna My happen. My like, you'd have to say, is in a proper good spot here at the moment. Yeah, I think so. But if there's one driver you'd want to be, it's uh, right now. It's it's Sanko. <laughs> he's ah, just yeah, he's out in a there, world P1, of his own. Is Magda going to go now past Raven? Look the inside. I think he is. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Is Raven going to try hold it? He is. He is. I think he will hold it as well. Oh, good defense. What a good move. defense. Yeah, he held around the outside very well. This is helping Dylan. Major think, well, although, yeah. well, now they're in DRS now. Dylan's going to be a yeah. sitting duck. Dylan's a sitting duck. Dylan could Dylan could fall down to PA really quickly here, uh, Brendan. I think so, yeah. Because, like, if if he does get in the midst of all this, he's just going to be a roadblock, and that's it. Like, it's also getting gonna... dark. Yeah. I the know, he's already true. Fans see... already true. Wow. <sighs> that's it, is the... As, as Ryan made a mistake, look how far back he is here. He's going to try and make the move now past Dylan, I think, isn't he? <laughs> Dylan's right behind Fatsho and he doesn't even have DRS. <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Rain's trying to switch back on these two, having a knock. Maglox and Dan O.M. Um, they, they both know there's a major podium on the, on the, on the cars yeah. here. They can sense it, everyone can sense it. Raven has to make these. Raven softs they're gone, Brendan. They're gone. He's he's in a really tough spot himself. Magdox has to sense that as well, doesn't he? Look, look, look. Oh, I don't know if the softs are really that bad. Like as in, I think they're gone, Brendan. I know, really think they're off a cliff. Yeah, it's about six percent a lap. Yeah, like I think they're gone. But Fangio is in a really good spot here at the moment. If, if oh, who's he that? Who's that making move with the inside? Down with the inside of Mags. Oh, Mike's had a little fucking kick of the ass into Dan. Careful, boys. Oh, going really side by side there is always really tricky. Good. Really good. Ah, oh. squeezing. Ah, oh, it's really good. It's really good. <laughs> now that brings Rian into it a bit. Mike's in Dylan is just. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is gonna be. Ah, oh, this, this is, is so be... close, man. Yeah, yeah. Oh, they, yeah, you yeah, can't. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you Dogs can't overtake so Dylan too breaks. quick. Yeah, I know. Oh, Ryan's so... oh, gone. Is he? Ryan. He's gone past Max. Oh, oh, is Max gone? Is he? Did he oh, catch he, it? No, he just held it. Oh, he my just held God. It. Oh, no, my God. that brings into it. And Section is nowhere. What? Section and Saucy are just, like, out of it, like. <sighs> Who's that gone past? Oh, the two. Ray can sniff it. I'm telling yeah, you. I'm Ray telling you. Dylan's Ravens finished. Through. Dylan, well, Dylan's finished. Dylan's in puncture territory now. Yeah. 
Oh, Ravens oh. are off the track. Is Bags gonna, is the ring gonna go past both of them? He is, isn't he? He surely is, isn't he? Who's this? I'm on board with Dan. Who's that? That Dylan. How is he gonna pass Raven? <laughs> oh, Dylan. Oh, Dylan's gonna try holding up there. He tapped him. What am I watching? This is, this is crazy. This is crazy. It's brilliant, but, but it's crazy. Gr great oh, racing. Rain's, like, Rain's true now as well. Rain's true now as well. Oh he's my god. Is Dylan the gonna Dylan's fight gonna it? Fight this. No way. I think he's... Oh. 22 lap old hair. That's fair play to him, by the way. But he's, yeah, he's, 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 done. he's done. He's done. Mag's up the inside now. Yeah. That's a shame for Dylan. Like, it just is. And, oh, he's got to try hold it. laps away. We're gonna have a last lap fight for, for two podium spots. Oh, someone's gone. Yellow flags. <gasps> Sanko! 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 No! <laughs> I don't believe it. What? I don't believe it. How did I lose it. that? And now Fanju's in the lead. Oh my god. Fanju's gonna win this. Oh my god. <laughs> this is ridiculous. And now Rian is chasing down Raven this for is the P3. the craziest race I've watched. Rian. What have we seen? Rain's what have we go just past seen? Him. Surely he's going to go past him. Oh my god, look at the he's speed. He's got no battery Raven. though. The speed of Raven in a straight. He's got to try to hold, is he? Around the outside. Mags is there as well. Now, they cannot seem to win here, Brendan, on the last lap. Yeah. Oh, Rian, Rian has to get this, like, because those, those softs will be. I I, I don't know. Does, finished, I, man, does he go for done. it now? Like. No, you wait for uh, the last. Surely last lap DRS. Like, oh, he's sending it. <laughs> Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, he's having... Oh, that's... Sanko retired. That is so oh, close. Sanko. Oh, no way, Sanko. In the pits, oh, in the pits. Oh. oh I've got it for a man. Yeah, that is criminal. crazy. That is the last way you want to lose a race, like, on the last I just ended a like... raven there as well. Switch back, switch back for my clocks. Rain is pushing. Rain is sending a P2 here. Fanjo has to win here. The mag if you just keep it on the track. Yeah. The softs are finished for Fanjo as well. Dylan, up, oh, Dylan, Brendan, they're finished. Yeah. Oh my God, this is so close. There's so much going on. More Dylan's off. Fights. Dylan's off. He has a puncture. Dylan has a puncture. Ah, uh, Dylan. Fuck. Uh, go back forward. Shame. Let's go back forward. Rain can send to P2. He can send to P2. Ravens finished. Ravens race is done here as well. I think. And the rain's coming as well. It's just oh started to rain. <laughs> it is, it is rain, isn't it? Oh, I can, it's can we make the move? I think you should. You should surely make this move. You gotta dive it. You gotta dive it. Oh, he's going up the inside. Yeah, right move, isn't it? He's got this, surely. He's got it. Oh, I went off board. Dan's trying to hold it. Dan's trying to oh hold it. What God. a defense. Yeah, he's not gonna hold it on the outside. Oh, yeah. Nah, he's not. That's well, brilliant. Fan, by the way, I miss Fanjo coming across the race. <laughs> what a race. What a race. Oh, what a race. What? That is the best race I think I've ever watched. That yeah, was crazy. Yeah, that was, that was right crazy. up there with among the best, like, of this My game, without God. a shadow of a doubt. My God. Across, across all the three seasons, this one definitely is right up there. Well Brendan, done, Fanjo. That I have a... to say, you're taking the lead in the, in the interviews. My voice is fucked. <laughs> That's right. You'll take a P3 and that, P1 yeah. this week. Anyway, my, I cannot <laughs> believe the race we've just watched. What a race. What a and race. the rain. Look at it. It's bucketing at the moment. Like, look at the rain. <laughs> I feel Jeez. so bad for Sanko. What? I'd love to know what happened to me. Just, like, at what part of the track did he lose it? Like, was it, um... Kind of on, uh, coming into sector three. The, exit, was it, the exit of the double left, man. The exit of the double left. Oh, that's the worst. I've I've seen. Yeah, people. I've seen people lose it there before. It's a, it's a nasty, nasty corner. Like it's so bad. Oh my god. I can't believe Fanjo won that race, man. <laughs> well, I can. It's because it's exactly. He was, the... he, he was seething in that interview and like in, in qualifying. You could hear him. I've never heard Fanjo was angry other than when he's racing Andy. Oh, but, but like, what a race! What a race, man. That was outrageous. <laughs> I just can't believe what I've just watched. I really can't. Brendan, if you do the honors for us, as I think I'm just about done talking. Ah, uh, no worries, man. Um, I'll run you through now. So, uh, Mr. Fangio takes P1. Uh, well done to him. Uh, P2 got Dan O'M. Great result by him. Brilliant Rian P3. Result. 
and that rounds off your podium. P4 to P10, uh, Mags, Raven, Colin B, Section, Saucy, uh, Dilzer and Con, And then from P11 down, we got Moss Megan, uh, Sandbag, Sanko, who lost the lead of the race on lap oh, 27. Poor, honestly, I felt so bad uh, for Sanko. And then Farrell, Daz, um, good, a good uh, debut by Daz as well. I've got to say, like even though we did retire, like it was still a good uh, debut. And then Seabox and Josh round off the grid. My <sighs> goodness, my goodness, what a race that was! I'm sorry, that is the best race I think I've ever watched. Yeah, that was like the right the, the standard of racing in that alone was just crazy. Brendan Hill might have won it in here. Uh, Find Joe Rain and Dan, wasn't it? Dan, yeah, yeah, yeah. My goodness, Jesus. Uh, Find Joe with Dan and Rain. My mother of Jesus, honest to God. What an absolute Jesus of a race. I can't even <laughs> speak anymore. Like, you can hear me, voice, my voice is gone. More of a Jesus I think we need Christ. to, like, yeah, I, I think we just need to uh, credit everyone as well in that race. Oh, the racing the, honestly, was really, it was, really good. Like, wheel to wheel action. You know what that was, and, Brendan? You know what? I'll tell you, it was a big fuck you to Australia. Like, there was, a, <laughs> there was honestly, no, that's no, genuine. There was a big stigma after Australia that. Whatever, our pair ones back to normal. That that was that was a big fuck you to Australia. That, that's what that was. Love and it. I think that'll agree with me. But we'll get we we'll wait for them to come in because race winner has just joined. Yeah, I'd say he's in a he's in a much happier mood than uh, when he was in qualifying. Anyway, who's that? There's Rain. Rain. Well, it's been a while. <laughs> yeah. Certainly like, has. We, we'll get to you now. And actually, we can keep. We're we'll right on Dan. I'm to join. Has Dan joined? No, he hasn't. <laughs> I'll give him another quick invite. As as you can hear me, I'm very hoarse at the moment. Just you just made me talk a lot there in that race. <laughs> As an invite, Dan. I'm hopefully he comes in for a chat. I'm sure he's been. He, he, I don't. He hasn't been in this room in a long hour time. So I'm sure he's eager for it. But Brendan's gonna take it away with P3 and P1 to Rian and Brendan, chat away. No worries. So, Rian, well, uh, welcome back. Ah, <laughs> uh, happy um, old chup, but. Um, how uh, how was that then? Um, how how was qualifying? Uh, and and then talk us through like obviously, pr- I, like I'm sure you were probably hoping for a bit more uh, than P3, but uh, how uh, how was it anyway on your side? Ah, oh, well, look, a pole and a P1 would be amazing, but. <laughs> Sanko, Sanko just had that extra tenth uh, today in on the one lap pace, and um, mm. he pulled out an unbelievable lap at point three, which uh, I probably could have got near it if I hooked everything up. Um, mm. But no, I was, I was happy out with P two. Been a while since I've been on the front row, so I was very happy with that. Yeah, definitely. No, it was it was great seeing you up there because like. Uh, you also lost me a bet with Carl because I said it would be a point five on pole, and you literally like <laughs> done like a a point five zero one or something. So it was like yeah, literally I... almost to the digit, like. And then Sanko just comes out of fucking nowhere and just absolutely nails it. Like, yeah, what's that? Right. Um, but um, talk me through, like, see, uh, when you pit uh, during the safety car, was that something that you anticipated you were going to do anyway, or was it just a spur of the moment thing? Yeah, that was I said it. I say it all the time before race. If I'm starting at the hards, it's, uh, if there's an early safety car, I'll pit medium, medium. Mm. Um, uh, I think it was the right decision in hindsight, but it was just really yeah. hard to get back through the pack. Um, yeah, I think we were all struggling on battery, and there was just no recharge, so mm. it was really difficult to make use of the new tires. Um, but. Oh, I felt really good on the hards and the four stint, and I felt it was probably quicker than Sanko when yeah. he was on the mediums. Uh, I did have to burn a shit ton of battery in the first three laps, uh, but once I settled into the DRS and stuff, I, I felt very comfortable. Yeah, well, this is it. Like, um, like I was saying to Carl, like you, uh, you're in a, like you're in a position. Uh, you're on the like Alex slower tire, but if you can just stay within the DRS, like. Like Alex Sanko will basically drag you along, and you were yeah. um, basically between the two of you. Is like you were pulling a gap. Like I think that uh, Colin was in P three, but you were dropping everybody like just just uh, rapidly, and then 
you on the hard tires you were just uh, you were just there the whole time but like um um yeah just in terms of um just the overall racing like was it kind of uh what was your mindset like when you were kind of in all that traffic towards the end like you're chasing down the podium like what were you sweating a good bit or was it kind of like uh just sort of take what comes to you like or well it's me mike some fans on the party we were all fairly calm to be fair we were just said to each other I pick our moves at the right time don't make anything uh, don't make any stupid mistakes and mm. we go from there it was just um I, it was a bit sweaty tense to i looked up and i see in lap 25 and i think i was still like p5 or p6 so i was like oh, you are lower than that or even lower than yeah, that, I don't know where that stage. and i was like oh look this the, the podium might be off the cards here but then i think when i got mags that opened the door up for me a little bit then to yeah. push on forward and then fortunately for us Sanko put it in a wall <laughs> um, couldn't believe it when I saw that I was like that was the it, craziest thing I've ever seen that, just... that was the that was the plan for the four stint as well because I was saying it to the lads uh, Sanko's rear end looked very loose out of a lot of, a lot of corners he was having a lot of snaps mm. here and there so I just wanted to try get as close as possible pressure him into a mistake but I guess the chase and pack pressure. Mm-hmm. Last question. Yeah. Is the championship on still? <laughs> if Look I had a wood, I'd finished. say yes. Look where Sassy finished. I'm not saying yeah, but if I had a wood today, yes. But it's it's not mm. out with, it's not out of contention. If we have war today, <laughs> as our races like today, then maybe. Yeah. No, you done everything you could today. And like you had a good qualifying, so that was the main thing. Just have a good yeah, qualifying just, and, that's and all you're I in there. Like, <laughs> yeah, just to get so through that's all I asked for. Is yeah, avoided that quality van this time, did you? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I, I went back, right? I went to the stream and I was like, I'm going to listen to what, because I seen you were on board. And I was like, I'm going to listen to what they said at the end when I went off. <laughs> And I heard Carl go, that's a quality van. I was like, what's this? Yeah. Yeah, he was, and I, was in the, I was in the party and all. Yeah, look, I'm not going back out. I'm safe and all. He's going to fuck off if he thinks I'm taking a quality van. Yeah. yeah. I'm back out for it. Ah, well. Uh, well done, Raymond. And, and um, hopefully we'll, uh, we'll, uh, we'll chat next week again, okay? So Ooh. good. Well done, right. Well, now I have the pleasure of reintroducing a man that's been gone for a while. It's LOI, that's OM. Hello. Well, it's, it's been, been a few a, seasons. It's been a while, all right. It must <laughs> must feel good to finally get that back. podium. You've been close enough for you. Party, it's been so long. <laughs> oh, I tell you, what, that was some race. I tell you, you must be sweating yourself. Bit of a blur, man. To be honest. Um, <laughs> so look, we get to the race. There, like it was. Grant. As Rian was saying, like I was, there was like five, six laps to go, and I was in like six, and I thought, <laughs> I'll just cruise around you know we'll get there <laughs> and then all of a sudden i'm in second and i'm like fucking hell what's going on here uh so honestly it was, so, uh, was, we, we, there was a, a lot bad, yeah yeah a lot happened to get us there but we'll get there in a second qualifying talk is really how did you feel did you feel as the pace is getting better as you as you proceed no, through the sessions there um no practice much really um <laughs> a couple of and you look that quick couple of practice couple of uh <laughs> couple of quality sessions with nothing worth talking about uh wasn't very confident managed to pull out a really good lap in q2 um, and did a decent banker in q3 but then just fluffed the fluffed second lap typically so uh, <laughs> wasn't ideal starting back in ninth but made a really good start i think i was up in p3 or p4 after the second sector mm, so i think there was a couple of collisions around me that i managed to avoid so i just got lucky there um Pace was okay. Together. I think it was pace was pace was much better on the hards than it was on the mediums. I felt I was going backwards a bit. Yeah, the, the deck in the mediums is mad um, on this track. Yeah, yeah. Uh, especially with the few lads on softs around us, it was kind of you didn't really know who was on what strategy with safety. Yeah, yeah. Some people absolutely. pitted, some didn't. You didn't know who was doing what. But uh, no, I was happy enough. I suppose after after the lag out in Jeddah last week, I was kind of. <laughs> That was a bit heartbreaking. Absolutely, so, uh, absolutely. But no, how did that safety car? Did that safety car kind of try to span around the walks for you? Uh, I suppose. Look, everyone was trying to predict the rain, like if it was going to come. So nearly did. <laughs> um, I kind of knew that. It, well, I said it was too early to pit. I thought for the mediums weren't going to go until the rain. So I said, look, I may as well stay out and roll. See what race. happens. Yeah. And I think it was probably the right call ultimately. Uh, I mind yeah. You, Rian kind of made the other strategy work as well, so could have gone either way. 
Yeah, it was one of them way. Like, if, if you're on the mediums, you have to stay out. But, like, you were on the heads, and you, I th- I personally thought staying out of the heads was a call because you could drag them an extra few laps and whatever. But, yeah. I, I couldn't have predicted what, what what was about to happen. Like, the pace was just crazy from every. Like, I think the whole top eight was separated within the DRS of each other for the whole 10, 15 laps after the DRS. And, yeah, it's competitive race. Oh, race. The, like I was watching this trying to break, like outbreak each other, and uh, <laughs> I was shit myself watching it because I don't know. I have this now. I have major skin issues. I can't do that stuff now. But <laughs> it was lap after lap after lap. Like the concentration alone was unbelievable. So, how did you feel like in that? Did you feel like a podium was on the cards as the race transpired? Uh, um, I knew I was there thereabouts, and the pace is okay. And yeah, I suppose about five six laps to go, I kind of. I kind of became aware that Colin's dig was quite high and he was struggling. And I knew the two soft lads in front were going to struggle as well. And obviously Dylan was out on the old hard as well. So I knew there was a few there to take if I just, uh, but there was also three or four lads behind me coming fast as well. So I had to try and keep them behind. Um, so I never really, I suppose I didn't really think at all that it, there was a problem. Yeah, you just let it happen. With, Definitely on the last lap, I'd say. <laughs> I was sweating a lot on the last lap, right? I tried to throw it away a couple of times. And then, suspect corners. And then obviously Ray and Sam's on you on the last, second last corner. Did you think uh, Alex no, beat no, he, from he P3 here? He I don't mean Sam, I mean he had a look. He had a look. Yeah, yeah. No, in fairness, he showed, showed good respect there. I think he could have easily uh, pushed me out more than he did and it would have been justifiable. But um, yeah, I know luckily I managed to get the... Managed to get the car rotated well and got the traction down oh, so just enough to keep him behind. Good to watch. Um, you no, finally no. got yeah. Fi- go on. No, no, go ahead. You're finally back. It's 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 been a long time coming. I have to say, you've always been sniffing about the podiums, and it's, it's weird. Been... You, your pace, your pace has seemed to come now with this game at the end of the game cycle, which I say is yeah, frustrating so. in a way that now you've unlocked this type of pace and PS5 you... hacks, I suppose. <laughs> Did you, oh, have you? Were you not on a PS5 before? No, I only got there about a month ago. <laughs> Directly correlates with my pace increase. It's kind of sad. But no, look, honestly, it's, um, it's, it's been a long time coming here. Your, your pace the last month, month and a half has been ridiculously. Like, you look back to your old self and maybe the Mercedes, Mercedes has a bit to do with that, but it's good to see. Honestly, it's been a long time coming and I expect... You're up there. You're not far off. The, do you think a championship run is possible here now? With the last few, five races to go. Do you think the championship uh, one is possible? We'll get ahead of ourselves. I suppose it's hard to predict anything with the, with the history tracks. Absolutely. I'm, I'm the kind of person who I either love a track or I hate it, so I, <laughs> um, that could be my undoing. Mm, fair <laughs> it's enough. A bad track. Um, but no, no, it's just good to be good to be enjoying it again anyway, and being That's able to actually race race people, you know. So it's yeah, it's been a while. Fuck you, Australia. That's all I'd say. <laughs> But yeah, she looked down. Fuck you, Australia is really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dan, we'll yeah, leave it at that for you. Um, it's yeah, good to have you back in here. It's been a long time coming. Absolutely. Hopefully, hear you again. <laughs> so look, we'll leave it be. Fair play, Dan, and I'm sure we'll probably be having a shout at some stage next week in some form. Cheers, lads. Go on. GG's. GG's. And we're going to change it up. Brendan's going to take the main man this week as I'm fucked. <laughs> Well, 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 look who it is. <laughs> um, right, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> right. Like, there's just a few things I want to clear up with you, right? Like, so when you were in here at the interview and qualifying, you were, I've never, I've never heard someone as angry. You were like, literally like you were seething. <laughs> everything you said that you needed literally happened. You got everything you needed. And I like, like to even, think it was a little bit of me. Uh, even, no, 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 I know, but even, <laughs> but you it called it, it, but even the rain came as well. And I was like, when the rain's come for Fangio, just as he is about to win it. So that was insane. Like, but um, I don't know, talk us through it. Like, what, what was it like anyway, like at the start and with the safety car? How, uh, how did you see it from your, your, uh, your end? I think Rian kind of said the party is fairly calm, but in my opinion, it was anything but calm. <laughs> my, but I never had a fucking dull moment, jeez. Like, starting at the back, I was on the hard, like, and so I was. I knew I wasn't going to pass anyone too quickly, but fucking mm. hell, your man Dad F1 from whatever tier he was, jeez, he was causing me some... I meant, I, I meant calmness after the restart, the safety <laughs> car restart, okay, the fair, first stint maybe not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, first stint was chaos, but uh, I think I tapped out at one stage, but I let him back 
by or whatever. But yeah, once the safety guard came out, it was a no-brainer because uh, I was already starting the hard, so I wasn't going to the end anyway on anything. And I mm. knew if anyone stayed out, they'd have to pit again. Uh, so I went mediums because I knew I'd have rest of the sauce for the end. And then from there, it was just trying to get through the first few lads without any damage or anything. Like, my, mm. myself and Sassy had the same idea at the restart. We just held back a, about a second just so we wouldn't hit anyone. Um, yeah. But then once I kind of caught up to Mags and uh, Rian, it was just about following them through and hoping the lads would pick quite early because I knew that the tired egg and this is mad from last season. Um when Andy mm. just blitzed us on those mediums. That's right, yeah. But, um, Thanks for reminding yeah. me about that. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I will say I was fuming. Oh, I wasn't fuming. I was annoyed because after the lads pitted, I just couldn't get into Mags and Reigns the arrest to save any arrests. So. <laughs> yeah, this is funny. Oh, I, was, I, I wasn't <laughs> asking to, but I was kind of... I had that. a feeling, do you wanna, yeah. Do you want yeah. to just slow down four tenths there, give me the arrest, but... Um, we kept getting oh, that to the straight yeah. and I kept moving myself. For fuck's sake, I'm not to do it again. But I think, I think I was a little more aggressive into the pitch than Rain, and then on the exit, mm. Dazer kindly let me by on the hard or whatever, and then I was kind of with Rain. And from there, for me, it was just chaos. It was just about keep burning, and keep burning, and just keep getting by as many people as possible. Mm. And I knew Dylan was going to the end of the hard, but I knew they'd be fucked by four laps to go or something. But, uh, yeah, and then I kind of mags fair play to him completely. Uh, let me go when we were passing Con B, so I appreciate that. And then when I was catching Sanko at three laps to go, it was coming down, but I wasn't sure if I get into the or not. And then the elation <laughs> went. That was <laughs> that was just mental. Like, yeah, I mean, like I'm even re- like I'm even dreading like listening back to the commentary because like when he spun, I just couldn't. I just went mad, like I just couldn't believe it. And then the actual realization then that you were the one in P2, and then that gap that you had on the softs was just yeah. it was just crazy how it all worked out in the end. Like, but like you know, oh, exactly. it was all about, but as you say, it was just all about like getting through the traffic as, exactly. as best and as clean just... you can. And I'd say, I'd say when Dylan was there as well, like obviously it's not his intention to like he's he's no, on the racetrack, no. he can hold his station as much as he wants to. But when you're up against that, like it is absolutely terrifying. And when you've got three or four or five cars all like all clamoring over the one position, um, and like it was, was just the... um, yeah, yeah, go on. No, I was just gonna say uh, it was just getting through those kind of cars that had pit earlier, and like ahead of you, you're screaming at them to to like go quicker because they're they're so slow compared to us mm-hmm. in the middle sector. Yeah. But it was just about trying to stay calm, as Ryan was saying, and pick your moments. But yeah, go on. I'm loving this passion. This is uh, this is a, <laughs> this is an angry Fangio that that, oh, uh, that hell, we're yeah. seeing here. Nothing's <laughs> gone my way, like. Uh, but an angry Fangio that is uh, nonetheless a race winner, and that means, as as far as I can see, I'm like, like I'm terrible at maths, but like, mm-hmm. when you factor in that saucy in section, I mean section, like in all seriousness, like he he definitely needed this race today in terms of mm-hmm. uh getting a good result but he didn't um Rian, i think has given himself a chance he's he's clawed his way back in there um but like that's the thing with you this season that like, you've you've been up there and it's just maybe a case of the results haven't come your way but like yeah, i would say at this stage and... you're either second or third now in the championship and you've put yourself right in there yeah, I don't so know. Like, like I, I know Sassy's like, still is it, in the way, so yeah. But, but like, is it like, just... like, is it like, uh, like attainable? Like, do you think you can go for it, or like after well, this uh, night I, today? I, I, I'd rate myself fairly high in the case that, like, I know I can win races, and I've shown I can do that. So it's just a case of <laughs> kind of bringing actually a bit of Colin B's kind of racecraft into my my game, where it just you just get points every race, and Dylan mm. does that as well. So. It's just a case of being up. To, like I know, if I'm around P5 or something, I'll be able to make a few moves here and there. And it's just about, I don't know, being there when it counts and having yeah. the chance to get points rather than just binning yourself on lap two, like. Or uh, binning it in lap 27, which is 
What's that yes, good fun and I, feel, I do so. feel bad for him because I have... I, fuck, I, I'd say we're all gutted for him. And, and then the <laughs> fact that he just leaves the session as well. And, like, just... I will, I will say, Colin B would be enjoying my uh, my commentary of the race because it, it was a bit of a him and Abu Dhabi moment a few seasons ago <laughs> when Franco binned it. But, uh, no, I just want to say as well, like, well done to... Rain and Mags in the party. It was good to get a good result, and obviously Dan, fair play to you. I, I didn't, I didn't realise you were anywhere near until the last few laps. So, fair play to you. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's it then. Uh, well done on on the win, and um, yeah, we'll hopefully hopefully see you back next week again. Hopefully not yeah. in qualifying. In the next week, it's but... sound, is it? Having a clue, actually. Oh, it's the mystery round. Yeah, it's, there we go. It's guitar, I heard. It's interesting. You know there's other facts in Canada, don't you? Uh, no. It's, 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 do you know what? I wouldn't mind Silverstone either. It's one of my best tracks as well. I, I, I know. I know. There's, a, there's another ad in this party like Silverstone, I think. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm right saying that now. I would Get love it if it's Monaco or something. If it was Monaco, that would do just you know be what? fucking brilliant. If it was Monaco... If it was Monaco, I'd back myself. Because <laughs> I, I, sh- I should have right, got Paul last right, season. It is. <laughs> we'll conti- hang on, we'll continue this chat off stream. Let me, let me end the stream here for <laughs> Right, thank you everyone for watching. It was, in, in my opinion, best race of the last three, four seasons combined. But we'll be back again next week. And my God, I hope your voice is better because I've a lot of talking to do. See you later.